Hello, everybody. Welcome. Sorry, it's been so long. Hello. Christ. Also, everything is wrong. Hold on. Everything you know is wrong. All right, guys. You ready to see the background, the the back end of everything, and how crazy this shit is? All right. First, I need to go to BG. Right. I don't uh, fucking we're on, know. We're on standard, so I need to go to standard. Can they even hear us right now? There we go. Nope, they can't. They have no idea what the hell's going on. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. So, say thank you to Cleo for these new purple gloves. Uh, speaking of purple gloves, they don't look very purple. They look purple to me. The reason they look purple is... Uh, they're not really that purple in real life. Are they not? Do they look the same amount of purple up there as they do here? Pretty much. Pretty much? They're much... They're a little on, on the pinker side than purple. Do they look the same up there as they do here? Basically. Yeah. To you. Okay. Uh, so, the question is, can you hear us right now? Because we were feeling kind of quiet in our headsets. Yeah. The monitor might just be quiet. I can turn the monitor up. If if we feel that well, we considering that Beast don't said yep. Okay, you can hear us both fine. Okay, okay, good. Sounds good. All right, I've been I've been really trying hard to balance the audio so that like you could go watch some YouTube videos where they haven't like cranked the volume to hell and back, Markiplier, <laughs> and then you could come back to us on the stream and we'd be okay. The VOD should be, let me just double check here, but we should be recording uh, our mic separately for the VOD. Um, let me just double check here. Yep. So the processed mic and music and all that stuff that's going to the stream is not being recorded to the VOD. The VOD is getting its own stuff that has no processing, no stuff on it. So that is all getting raw, unfiltered audio that can then be adjusted in Premiere later for the VOD when we upload the VOD to YouTube and maybe do highlight reels. Still working out highlight reels, how those will work, but uh, at the very least, the VODs will be super high quality. Dudes, the video quality on them is so good now. Between like getting high quality CQP renders from the recording and then having the VP9 encoder from doing 1440p uploads. And, and a baked potato. And a baked potato. And a cake too. And a cake too. Some you. Also some you who. Also, something that I can talk about. Art got new ear cups for my headphones too. Yay! And now I look like I have frosting on my ears. I <laughs> <laughs> also got a new, I got a headband. For mine. Oh, to, I didn't see that. Yeah, it. Uh, I noticed that the. <laughs> that is the gamer equivalent of like a Russian mom with like the cloth oh, wrapped the around. Yeah, wrapped around her head. That is the gamer equivalent of that. You have True. a gaming babushka. <laughs> hey, Graydon. Oh. Um, yeah, I noticed, like, you don't wear your, your your headphones as much as mine, which is why it was so weird to me that your ear cups looked like they were in way worse condition than mine. That's because my ears radiate enough, enough heat to destroy <laughs> countries. Um, but I noticed that my headband, the leather on my headband, was starting to flake a bit. So I was like, well, you know what, I'll grab... Uh, this is made by the same company that makes these he ear cups whom we are not sponsored by. Could be though. I like your product, sponsor us, Wicked Cups. Anyway, uh, you know, we'll bring your uh, the attention of like three dudes to your stuff. Wicked Cups sounds like the brand of a bra you could buy at Hot Topic. <laughs> <laughs> kind of does, yeah. But, uh, but yeah, so it was nice because I got uh, every time you order something from Wicked Cups, you get a discount on your next order, which is cool. So I got a I got a nice discount on both the protective band and the new ear cups for Panda. Um, 
they have other subtler colors, but I decided, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> we are streamers. Give them the biggest, stupidest ear cups that they have. They have to look at it. Might as well be interesting. Precisely. So, uh, tonight we're going to be doing some Ocarina of Time, but we're going to do two things to make it a little more interesting. One, we're going to turn on all the crazy settings, but two, we're going to start off our stream by mixing liquor. Woo! Woo! Alright, where's the... Gonna have to mix these one at a time, though, since we no, don't we have, like... Just... I brought the... Oh. I brought the mixing... The mixing thing. <laughs> How many ounces do you think goes into this? Uh... Before it's, like... Halfway? Dude, you could put, like, at least a cup in there. So, eight ounces? Probably somewhere between... Probably somewhere between, like, eight and... I'm just trying to calculate how many of each ingredient I need to put in. Oh, I'd say do like, for each of us, do like two ounces. Well, let's let's talk about what we're about to make. We're well, don't tell them the name okay. yet. All right. Just. So, uh, I'll hand them to you. And where's the? Here's the. Here's the. Jigger. Might have to have my mic away from me for a moment so I have room. Yeah. Here we go. All right. So you'll have the thing. I'll hand. I'll hand the ingredients to you, and you add them right now. as we go. Let me. Oh, I need the... There's the this. jigger. All right. So, um, for each of these cocktails, we're going to have two ounces of monkey shoulder scotch. Will that be unreversed in my picture? No. No. Yours is also reversed. <laughs> it's, it's monkey shoulder scotch. There we go. We'll reverse it in post. All right. So, it's two ounces each. So it'll be four ounces in total. All right, so we need two of the big jiggers. There we go. That's one. See me pour it in. Woo, all over my pants. <laughs> <laughs> and that's uh, two. There we go. All right, all right. four ounces. Uh, as, as far as we know, scotch, just, just use scotch. But we, we got monkey Scotch shoulder because it was like... chosen for, for a very specific purpose. Yes. All right. So now... Next is one ounce of uh, this Mr. Black uh, coffee liqueur. Uh, Ca again. Mr. Uh, Calberm. Calberm. Uh, so it'll be just the one full jigger of the coffee liqueur. There we go. All right. Coffee liqueur added. And this is meant to be served, uh, not chilled. As far as we know. As far as we know. We, we haven't actually tried it yet. We haven't experimented with it a whole lot. And then... Mm, I like that coffee liqueur. Uh, two, hold on, let me seal this up so I can show. Uh, one, uh, one ounce of the, of, uh, just good old classic De Kuiper butter shots. Butterscotch schnapps. Here we go. So... It's bloop, 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 bloop. So it's two parts scotch, one part coffee liqueur, one part butterscotch schnapps. I just noticed that this says not for lab or stovetop <laughs> use. We're looking at you, YouTube chemists. <laughs> <laughs> Butter shots, let's go. All right, stir it up with a classy bar spoon. Didn't make as much as I thought it would. Well, I mean, there's whole fucking bottles down here. We can make more if we want it. And, uh... Ooh. Where'd the other glass go? Got oh, right you have it. Okay. <laughs> What's it at? Just pour it in little bits at a time and aim for half. What is bedeedly doodling at oh, me? Oh, fuck off, Windows Update. Oh, no. Go, go, go. No, I'm not restarting. Stop, Windows. I hate you. Chiral. Chiral, thanks for the subscription. Everybody, a woo in chat. <laughs> Fucking God damn it! <laughs> Here I am trying to get be nice and get drunk. And you assholes are coming in here, giving us money. Ready for drink. Pieces. Alright, all right, drink. Alright, good enough. 
If we want more, we can get more. Is the T... Why is the TV mute not muted? I don't know, because you didn't mute it. I did mute it, though. Dumb fuck. You did not. Oh, it's coming through the fucking speakers. That's why. Nope. Okay, hold on. So Dad's probably getting all mad because we dare to be loud. Great. But that means that it was going to the wrong destination. It needs to go to there. Galoop, galoop, galoop. All right, I can have my microphone back now. Oh, that explains why we were quiet in our headphones. Because it was going why? to the TV. It, it, the spe it was going to the TV speakers. Well, ours and wasn't going. I hear us better now. <laughs> Weird, but also I want this. Okay, so. So, just to, just to recap. Two parts scotch. One part Mr. Black coffee liqueur. One part... Uh, Butterscotch, Butterscotch schnapps, schnapps because schnapps. all night I keep saying peach schnapps. I even, when I was telling a friend about it, about it on Discord, I even texted to them <laughs> peach schnapps. Well. And then it was like, no, god damn it. Why is peach schnapps the only schnapps that exists to me? <laughs> all right, so uh, let us have... Now that we have properly mixed this. Cheers. Cheers. Alvin and the Chipmunks, everyone. Yep, still works. Whoo! That's powerful. Mm. That's powerful stuff. It's very dry, which is surprising given that there's butterscotch schnapps in it. Yeah, that's the scotch working its magic. Super, super, like, rich. It's, it's got that, it's got that scotch fire. That, that. And that's immediate and up front. But, uh, I think, uh, the butterscotch is the next most potent flavor. Like, you taste that after. And the coffee liqueur kind of works as just sort of like this overall like supporting region. flavor yeah. that's always present oh. underneath. It provides like this extra smokiness. So why Alvin and the Chipmunks, you might ask? If they even realized that the reason why I was saying Alvin and the Chipmunks <laughs> was because that That's was the name of the drink and the not cocktail. just me screaming things randomly in a <laughs> drunken stupor. Um, Big potatoes! <laughs> we decided we wanted to make a cocktail called Alvin and the Chipmunks, and what would it be? And we decided to try these ingredients as a first step, and it worked miraculously <laughs> um we wanted the the objective was that the three that the three elements in it would represent the three chipmunks right so simon <laughs> needed to be something classy and upscale so, so we did the coffee, coffee liqueur. liqueur uh theodore needed to be something sweet and saccharine so uh, Butterscotch schnapps, Butterscotch schnapps also and seems things, thematically appropriate because right. he's the he's the chubby one, the right. candy lover. And those two already seem like they would go yeah. well together. So then the third one, this was the tricky one, is Alvin. Because Alvin is annoying as fuck. Alvin's an asshole. Yeah. So the Alvin one has to be kind of abrasive. Yeah. And it has to kind of make you wonder, is this good? <laughs> that was the effect, is that when we got all done with it, we wanted you to go... Is this good? <laughs> like right up front, just You're like oh, oh, that's Bernie. That's alcoholy. That's weird. And then, but is then, like the rest of flavors, good? sort of start to come through. Yep. And you go, ooh, that's nice. And that is exactly what this does. You get whammed in the face with scotch first thing, like I think, like it rolls over my tongue, and I immediately get that like peaty. <laughs> earthy scotch flavor. Right? I thought about that, Cairo. And I'm wondering if this would work with the milk float. Mm, you know what? Dave is ice. <laughs> you, you add ice, and that's Dave. He cools it down. No, he doesn't. Yes, he, does. he fucking he shouts, Tom and Jerry he shouts sits, Alvin. He shouts Alvin and does a Tom and Jerry that's sketch That's all with Dave him. does, is shout Alvin. Unless you're talking about the CG movies. No, I want to make this express... Es I want to make this clear. 
This is a drink that's meant to represent the 80s chipmunks. Yes, not the 60s chipmunks, the 80s chipmunks. Well, yeah, we don't know jack shit about the 60s chipmunks. The 60s chipmunks were somebody drew a picture to justify somebody's idea of like a funny album, which is, ha ha, speed them up twice as fast, and now they sound squeaky. <laughs> So yeah, this was this was very nice. Yeah, I was I was honestly surprised. I really thought we were making a gimmick cocktail. You know, the kind of shit they throw together at frat parties that involve mayonnaise, spaghettios, and where you like torches. You take your friend to uh, you take your friend to a bar, and you're like, "Have you ever tried an Alvin and the Chipmunks?" And they're like, "What the fuck is an Alvin and the Chipmunks?" And they're like, "You should try it." Ha ha. And they're like, "This is disgusting. I just wasted ten dollars on a cocktail, dick." I don't know why Alvin and the Chipmunks was the thing that popped up in their mind. It probably was just runaway train of thought at the time. Yeah. Um, still need to put like googly eyes or something on these <laughs> so that I get used. To, like I want to talk to the camera. Oh, on the camera. I thought you meant on these glasses. Oh no. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I <I've> spilled <laughs> on my brand new. <laughs> That's okay. There's whiskey all over my pants over no, here. No, and the couch we we have a new couch cover thing because the last they, they time we were it, streaming they can kind of see it behind you they can't see it behind me because i'm a mountain <laughs> the last time we were streaming panda noticed that i, I smelt a burning toast and considering what was going on in the stream at the time i was concerned that i was having a stroke <laughs> but it turned out that it was just funky butt sweat smell that was like has like absorbed into the leather of the couch. It's okay. horrible. Okay, don't first... get leather. Don't get leather furniture, guys. Cairo, uh, I don't know who John Taffer is, but he already sounds like the bar version of fucking um, Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay, and I therefore disregard what he says I should do in my in my little uh. Why would thingy? Why would he be upset about that? Yeah, Two we just. Parts... <laughs> Two parts. That's what I'm confused about. It's like, is it the amount of stuff we used, or is it the, the way, way I poured it? it? Like, was it because I poured? I accidentally poured it. Accidents fucking happen, man. And also, what also, you? the guy I watch how to drink. He, when he's <laughs> oh the measuring cup. Oh. <laughs> Look, we're in fucking rural Pennsylvania. Yeah. Eat my dick. <laughs> we're not the queen. It works. <laughs> I have this like being a queen ooh, la -dee -da. like this bar spoon is now one of my favorite possessions But I want to point out I would like to point out that the only reason we were using that was because I couldn't afford anything else I spent $300 today, today on booze, booze and, and booze, booze accessories <laughs> And not even all the booze accessories I wanted they didn't have a lot of the stuff like I did want to get that stirring Carafe, mm. specifically meant to throw ice in it and for stirred drinks instead of shaken drinks. I wanted a Boston style shaker setup, but they didn't have. They one. didn't have that. that like the reason I want the Boston. Probably gonna have to order something like that. The Boston style shaker setup is way better than what you usually get for your shakers, which is problematic because they tend to seal <laughs> way too slow. I thought you were gonna spend three hundred dollars on the spoon. <laughs> This is um, the most amazing spoon. <laughs> um, uh, the kind of shaker you can usually get at a store somewhere mm. is the kind where it's got like the the nipple, lid on it, and you kind of the nipple lid. And the problem with that is that the cold creates suction, basically. All right, and it just. Slorps that oh, on yeah. tighter than you, can, you where you can't even get like the little jigger off the top. Yeah, and if it's a hot drink, like it'll it fucking explode. Mom told like I went to make that lime cordial, and I it needed hot water to help dissolve the sugar. Mm -hmm. And I go and mom was like, "Oh, you'll want to keep like the lid kind of off," and I'm like. But I'm blending a fluid. <laughs> She's like, yeah, but last time your dad blended something that had hot liquid in it, it literally immediately exploded. Yeah, it's because the hot... it 
it tries to make the gases inside the container expand because it's hot and that makes the <laughs> lid shoot off. Taffer's bar Gordon Ramsay if Gordon Ramsay had an even worse temper and threw things. That sounds, sounds like a person terrible. I am going to immediately disregard when I have a man who is much more pleasant to watch and get advice from. Um, so what were the other things I got? I got uh, a you got, you got the scotch, you got the butterscotch schnapps, you got the coffee liqueur, you got the the rum. That rum was my favorite of the alcohols it's we really grabbed. Good. It's so good. Like it's not a spiced rum, but it's got it's got that molasses sweetness. It's so good. I got you a fresh bottle of New Amsterdam. New Amsterdam. A massive bottle and a concerning amount of bottles. Hold on, I'm a bottle. Go get it. Like, that's the kind of thing that your, like, mom or your significant other or best friend would walk into your room, see on the shelf, and get concerned. All right, hold on. Hold on. I'm going to go get it because it's it's ludicrous. It's, it's cordial if you're a communist. <laughs> Here in America, it's cordial. <laughs> Uh, Kraken's pretty good. I like Kraken. But it's, uh, it's not a spice drum. It's just a standard five-year-aged drum. Um, and then for myself, I got myself a uh, bottle of gin. Um, what was the name of it? I'm having a hard time bringing up the name. Started with a P. Plymouth. That's right. Plymouth. Plymouth gin. Um, and it's not its not a super fancy gin. I like it. Um, I have a hard time with gin sometimes because it's a very botanical. Yes. Did I get the name right? Yeah, Plymouth gin. For some reason, my brain just kept screaming. It's plagiarized gin. I'm like, that's... No one would even call their gin that. Yeah, Plymouth gin. Be fun to call your gin plagiarism. Sure, nice. Uh, pretty root, pretty uh, earthy and rooty in its flavor. Ugh. All right, I like it. So here's the deal. Show them the Plymouth Gin, right? All right, Plymouth Gin. This is a big bottle of gin. How much did that cost? Thirty-five bucks. Thirty-five bucks. Here is the bottle of New <laughs> Amsterdam gin. Like, give me that. Give me that gin. Like, <laughs> tink. Here's the bottle of New <laughs> Amsterdam, right? This is twenty-five dollars. Thirty-five. 25. <laughs> now, I consider myself a gin connoisseur. I like gin. I will drink gin on its own. It's like, just pour it over ice and drink it. Right? This is one of the best gins that I've ever had, and it is dirt fucking cheap. Like, this is... How much was this? One and a half liters? It's massive. Where's it? It says somewhere on it how much it is. <laughs> You turn it around. Excuse me. 1.75 liters. Almost two liters. <laughs> Almost two liters. $25. I don't think you can even buy single things of water that big in some <laughs> yeah. stores. Um, but of the th of the accoutrements I got, got the lovely little bar spoon here. I got a hand juicer for getting fresh juice out of lemons. Uh, found Realized that I need to get a proper zester for when you want a lot of zest and not just a zesty twist right so i need something for the scraping because i had when i was doing the cordial i had to sit there with uh mom's cheese grater right and just sit there with that and try to figure out how to make that work um that is true more expensive doesn't always mean more better and yes this bottle design is epic it looks like uh, it looks like future booze. Um, it looks like a. What's the. Come on, Ark. You're a typographer. Mm. <laughs> it looks like Bauhaus, Bauhaus style, like. Oh, yeah. Buildings. <laughs> I have an entire Doom Wad where the levers. Levers. <laughs> levels are designed. Drink more. <laughs> in the Bauhaus style. Mm. And it is very distinctive. Like, very interesting to look yeah. at. Um, so I got bar, 
bar spoon, the uh, juicer. I got the strainer for when I eventually get the Boston style shakers. I uh, got the hand zester for getting that little, just that little twist off a of lemon so you mm -hmm. can get that zesty squeeze and mm -hmm. garnish your drink. It's even got a, another end that you can just quick do some scrapes just for garnish if you just need garnish. Right. I'm the same, just making some adjustments. Mm, what else was there? I wanted to get. I wanted to get a uh, ice ice cube tray to hopefully make those gigantic cubes. They had those at Wegmans. I no, they didn't. Yeah, they did. I went looking and I they saw they were down on the bottom shelf. Yeah, I found the ice cube trays. I didn't see the big square ones. I was looking there and it's like, oh, all they got is the regular. They kind. had they had big ice cube bolts. They had for like squares and the spheres. How do you even do the spheres? Um, you like clamp them together and then there's a hole in the top and you put the water oh. in and then you, when you go to take them out, you just open them up and take the Because the only way I've seen them able to be made is you, you get a block, a square block of ice and you put it in this heated press oh. that squeezes it and melts all the <laughs> stuff so you need that stupid. isn't a, a sphere. You just get a silicone mold that's in two yeah. parts. In but, a sphere uh, shape, pour the water in the, through a little hole in the top and freeze it. One of the purposes of a bar spoon is to crack ice. You whack it like that, and you can crack it over your drink and shake it. So. And I want to do that at least once. But uh, this can be used for other things, like uh, it's good for doing floats. Like I mentioned, a milk float mm -hmm. earlier where you just sort of pour it onto the spoon gently so it, like, starts floating on the top of the drink. Uh, I also got a few other things, like uh, the Angostura bitters, the orange... Orange bitters. Orange bitters. Some grenadine. Some grenadine. Basically, he's stocked up, because, like, he's got this, like, drawers. Is it a chest of drawers? Is that what that is? I think so, because it's not a proper... Um, it's not a wardrobe. It's not a proper wardrobe because it doesn't it's have like a drawers. tall section. For, I think like, it's a chest of drawers. Yeah. Um, but he's there's like a few drawers in it right it's now. Just filled with stupid shit. Yeah, that... filled with crap like old video games that it's just like 360 games that could go somewhere else and some random cables and shit like that. I mean, but, like, the 360 game should go upstairs to where the 360 yeah. is. Um, but it's also got shit in there like. Uh, uh, there's a lot of old vape. Yeah, like ancient vape devices. Yeah, that are that like they came to me secondhand. And they were like, maybe you want to use this, and I'm like, maybe. No. <laughs> they just need to get trashed, but I didn't want to just throw them away, dude. Not like not, and I don't this mean this would go so well with a good cigarette. Like a like a good camel, just like this and it, dude, dude. We're already drinking on stream. Don't encourage smoking. No, <laughs> look. At least suggest a good cigar. No, here's the thing though. I don't like cigars as much as cigarettes. They're not as smooth. I find them all to be really harsh and unpleasant. Like good cigarettes, like camels. You haven't had a clove cigar. That doesn't really count, though. Sure does. That's not. That, I'm. I'm thinking like tobacco, though. That is tobacco. <laughs> it's Clothes not, aren't tobacco. Clothes are something completely different. But it's not. It's not literally just clothes yes, that you burn and is. breathe in. Because every because the people like it's you go to tobacco the actors with some clothes who in. are like the actors who are like I don't want to smoke, but I'll smoke clove cigars for the movie. That's because they're being fucking stupid. That okay, fair. Actors are dumb. <laughs> I said it here. It's on the record. <laughs> Take that, Sean Shiplock. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Eat my ass. <laughs> Either way. Um, do, do, do. Do, 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 but no, do, like, do, uh, do. honestly, this would go to just, I could see just like chilling outside a bar. Like, you remember uh, the... What was the what was the bar in Binghamton? The um that closed down because the owner 
sad, like, and I say this in the most loving way, didn't know how to run a business. Um, the cyber, the cyber cafe West. I only went there once and it was before I was old enough to drink. That dude was like the nicest dude ever. And he could not run a dude, business. I do remember life. when we went there once and it was a real nice looking place. And I remember sitting there going, it was fun. Yeah. Like, they had I, a nice atmosphere. I had got a chips. chance to go upstairs. Uh, cause I had friends who knew the owner so they could like go upstairs and just chill out up there. And it was cool. <laughs> they had karaoke night. That was cool. Um, but anyway, um, Cyber Cafe West was the one place where I went and they had like seating out on the back patio <coughs> and uh, I got there and then we went out we were hanging out on the back patio and there were just people hanging out and one dude pulls out like a vape device except it was a uh, cannabis vape device and he like I was like looking at him I'm like oh hey nice and he's like yeah you want some and I'm like freeze <laughs> I'm driving probably shouldn't but like that was very close to my first experience with like proper marijuana it wasn't until later that we would do the weed brownie which was fun that was fun um, um and much later when like now I have my own like little bubbler bong thing <laughs> just and I will agree, Creighton. I feel like <coughs> cigarettes have cigarettes, especially even good cigarettes aren't great to smell secondhand. Like maybe like right off the cigarette, they're okay. But like any amount of time wafting, they become awful. Like you smell a smoker's car and it's terrible. Um. But, like, of all the things I've smoked, including pipes, cigars, nothing has quite hit the spot for me like a good camel. Like, whatever it is, whatever magic they have in that little death stick is just, mwah. it's just solid. I would love to taste like a classic camel. You know, I think I heard somewhere that uh, in the England, in the England land, uh, all the like cigarettes has to be kept behind the counter in really not obvious, mm -hmm. just white containers, and the cigarettes act at the packages. The actual cigarettes have to have like blazing pictures of like actual yeah. ruined organs. I and think that might be true in Australia too, Creighton. You could probably tell us where it's like the packages, like they can't even have like branding on them. It's just a big pack that says, this will <laughs> kill you. And it's like, that's it. Um, although, have you noticed at the, like at the pump and pantry, they have signs up everywhere now that say shit like J. Philip Morris has had to admit has had to admit that they deliberately made cigarettes more addictive and shit <laughs> like that. Like they got apparently a lawsuit was finally won that absolutely fucked them. And now, at least in Pennsylvania, they have to post shit everywhere saying how terrible they are. <laughs> They have many warnings, images of the effects of smoking. Yeah. Like here for a long time, it was just like they had to have a little note on the side that said this product has connections to cancer. Yeah. But now it looks like they're going <coughs> real hard, like not quite that hard, but it wouldn't surprise me if that's in the near future. But, you know, I've I have smoked in the past. I've smoked cigarettes. And I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, yeah, cigarettes are terrible. I like smoking. Like, if it's a good quality cigarette or cigar or pipe, I enjoy it. I'm not going to I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, yeah, cigarette. like, it's enjoyable. Um, it's just really, really bad for you. <laughs> so, um, so that is why I'm saying as a person who enjoys a good camel smoke, 
and knows that they're really bad for you and suggests that you not make a habit of smoking them, this shit would go real good with a camel. I would love to just sit outside on a cool night, drinking this, smoking a camel. It'd be so good. Ah, uh, all right. We drank a lot and boozed a lot on this. No, you know and what? It's, about it's, booze about it's a, lot. a just chatting stream now. <laughs> no, we got to play some Zelda. Why? We're having such a good time. We're just chilling. Let's at least finish our drinks first. Because we're going to be playing Zelda and we're going to be like knocking shit over. Let's at least finish our drinks first. So how are you guys doing? No, we're playing Zelda. <laughs> no, no. The problem that, is this isn't gonna go away fast. This is a sipping. I drink. know we're we're just we're chilling. We're hanging out. We've got lots of time to play Zelda. It's only ten fifteen. So is she speaking Russian? Maybe. <laughs> Very weird sound. I'm just like. Sorry to hear that piece now. Oh yeah. I know some people have been going some, through some rough shit lately. But I hope I hope things pick up for you guys. Um, I've had three of my friends go through some shit recently. It feels like every time I talk to someone, it's like, oh, great, some new shit. Why can't things just leave us alone? Like, can we just have like a year where nothing sucks? No, because we're in our mid-30s, getting older, now's the time when everything starts cascading because it's like, oh, yeah, of course this is when loved ones are going to start dying. Yep, that's true. Dude, let... Okay, we're going... It's Dr. Phil time. <laughs> um, okay, real question for you. What if, like, Genie the Bottle or whatever showed up? Like, somebody who knew you knew could, like, change shit, right? <clears throat> showed up and said I will give you one year where everything goes great right you are not unhappy nothing nothing happens to make you unhappy you're just everything lines up for you it's a great year nobody dies nobody gets sick no you know everything is just awesome for a year in exchange the next year World War three no, what a terrible It's not even a monkey's paw That's a monkey's fist to your dick <laughs> It's a monkey's scrotum Like <laughs> I would not trade One year Of wonderful happiness For the m deaths Of millions and millions Of people all across the world What if it was Everybody's happy for a year Nothing bad happens to anybody for a year. Even Eight that would not be people. great because we're talking about something that could be like permanently devastating for the Earth as a whole. So maybe things are great for people now, but you know, future generations are going to come back and go, man, this planet is a shit old thanks to World War III. I'm glad it all happened because that one douche made it <laughs> packed with an otherworldly entity just for one year. <laughs> of happiness. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. It'd be hard to. It'd be hard to. Cause like, like on the one hand, I'm totally with you that like everybody, like oh, the suffering of a world war. But on the other hand, a whole year where everybody is just happy. Nothing shitty happens to anybody for a whole year. Nobody goes for a whole year without anything shitty happening to them ever. I think I think that was 2012 for me. <laughs> yeah, for you. You said anybody one time. You didn't see everyone at once. I had mine in 2012. Oh. <laughs> but like... Like, a whole year where just everybody gets to be happy for a year. Like, do you think that the world would vote for that? Like, that if you, like, if you made it a democratic vote, if you're like, all right, here's the scoop. You get to be happy for a whole year. Nothing shitty happens to you. After that, World War Three. <clears throat> 
like it like it's one thing if it's just you deciding for everybody but what do you think that everybody would decide do you think everybody would say okay yeah i would like a year i think of world happiness. war three would start over that decision <laughs> <laughs> Russia be like, we're pressing the button, and United States be like, you're not pressing that button. Launch the nukes. <laughs> no, here's the thing though, Creighton. Like, you also would know that you have this big countdown clock, right? But part of the wish is that everybody is happy, right? So that countdown clock wouldn't matter. Because by definition, you have to be happy. That's the requirement. So maybe it's just unbridled stupid <laughs> optimism that everybody's like you know what that's not gonna happen like that's bullshit we're just you know and everybody's just stupidly no we can avoid in it denial like how hard is it not to start a third world war everybody's by the time the year's happy. over everything will be fine yeah, and then like, by the end of the year, everyone snaps out of their drunken stupors from the <laughs> never-ending year-long party vendor that they were on. Suddenly, two wakes up and he's like, "Wait a minute, I hate Ukrainians!" <laughs> oh no, you can't! Not now! <laughs> oh, this is why we don't drink on stream. <laughs> uh. Oh. <laughs> this is why we should be playing Zelda right now. No, we should be finishing our drink. Because then the Zelda will be better. I have managed to. What are you talking soak about? The myself. Zelda's the this Zelda's the best Zelda, uh -oh. chosen by a democratic vote. <laughs> oh no! How did oh this Jesus happen? Christ! <laughs> I think I went tonk and my drink said, I don't want to be a part of this anymore and jumped into my shirt. <laughs> Dude, Chiral. You don't have to try to be a pessimist. Believe me, I know. Pessimism, I feel like, is the natural state of things. It's hard to avoid pessimism. It's much easier to look at the things that have happened see patterns in the bad yep because they're a lot more prevalent in your mind it's like you know you ask any artist and it's like they could receive thousands and thousands of positive comments on their artwork every day but then one bad comment comes by and it sticks with them oh trying not to be a pessimist yeah well i mean like, that, that that's kind of what's getting is it, it's hard not to be a pessimist you have to you have to work i misread at his it. thing i think i thought he said he was trying to be a pessimist oh <laughs> will you children stop spilling your drinks no mama <laughs> oh, i refuse because that's what capri sons are all about is trying to make you not spill your drink until you like sit there stabbing at it for like a solid half hour <laughs> trying to like, get the little straw why won't this fucking straw go in i hate you capri Sun. see the thing is there's more than one way to spill a drink and if your drink is squeezable <laughs> like all it takes True. is a moment of oh shit i almost tripped clench fist out of fear Capri Sun in the air. <laughs> now, before anybody says controller tape, you're just sitting on Zelda instead of using the IRL, like the just chatting thing, so that you can get more views, you cheating fuck faces. We don't have more views. What yeah. are you talking okay. about? I would like you to go over and compare how many people are watching Ocarina of Time versus how many people are watching just chatting. If we wanted more views, we'd be set to just chatting. We are not shills. We are drunk. It's different. <laughs> Put the straw in upside down, make a little pond in the base. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck your gusset. This is. I've actually done that. <laughs> have you, have you, you done you that? Take it, it and you jammed it in upside down. Because that was the only way you Squeeze could... it a little so that it fills the little basin. <laughs> yup. <laughs> if you haven't done that, you haven't been a child. 
since the 90s. I don't think I've done that. When when did Capri Sun come out? It was definitely in the 90s, oh, right? Oh, Capri Sun was invented in 1752. <laughs> By Alexander Hamilton. It was known as Fruit Newt back then. Fruit Newt. <laughs> okay, some, hold on. Something has been called Fruit Newt. <laughs> Powerstone oh, says oh, Capri Sun existed at least in the late 80s. Like I said, Fruit. 1752. Fruit Newt. Okay. It is an existing search term. Fruit. No, I did not mean Fruit Boot. <laughs> um... Is a coconut a fruit, a nut, or a seed? Why are my fruit not growing? And you may ask... Okay, hold on. What subreddit do you think that question is on? What question? Why are my fruit not growing? Uh... R slash balls? <laughs> My my fruits are so small. Why aren't they not growing yet? <laughs> what do you think, chat? I found the question, why are my fruit not growing? What subreddit do you think that that's on? Power Stone, don't ask how I know. You're in a fucking... You're in a fucking Mountain Dew Discord channel. I know exactly how you know. Power Stone, guess... R slash men's health. It's not a terrible guess. <laughs> Is there an R slash balls? <laughs> Probably. And does it have anything to do with balls or balls? <laughs> well, does it have anything to do with balls like catch the ball, Timmy? Or does it have anything to do with ah, oh, my balls, Timmy? Why? <laughs> I went to r slash dicks, but I couldn't tell if it was about dicks or dicks. <laughs> uh, Carl guesses r slash stupid questions. It's not a terrible guess. There are no wrong guesses here, but there is, in fact, one true response. So I guess all other guesses are wrong. Uh, is it r slash why are my fruit not growing? <laughs> was, was it a, a very, very specific, specific subreddit, subreddit made by that one dude? Um, it's Stardew Valley. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Like, I was trying, like, you asked that question, I'm like, I feel like it would be in, like, a subreddit about gardening, so I you feel think. like it would be, like, but then you're, so I'm thinking that uh, he's asking because it must be weird, right? Right. So I'm guessing weird things, but then it's like, oh, no, I, I see why that would be asked in a Stardew Valley. What's crazy is... Like on on Google search, it ten it like lumps uh, multiple search results from a single website into a category, right? But Reddit counts as one category. So you have why are my fruit not growing from our Sunhaven, which is about Stardew Valley. Uh, then you have fruit not working from our Grand Piece Online. Le Peroni fruit not dropping from our Wild Hearts game. Uh, Fire Dragon fruit not spawning from our Tower of Fan something. And onion Tower fruit of fan not service. <laughs> onion fruit not working for more than five minutes from our T O R, which I'm not sure what that's for. Uh, the Ocarina of B fruit not rot. Rob. <laughs> fruit not candy landing page what is the texture of a fruit which is okay word request from english language learner stack exchange so this is for people who are learning english as a second language yeah wait hold on onion fruit all right hold on let's go back <laughs> uh The fuck? 
Onion fruit not working for more than five minutes. Could this be a Windows issue with the firewalls, my ISP provider, or something else? Are there alternatives to route all my traffic through for? What the fuck is onion fruit? <laughs> This is a closed source program, and if you have issues with it, the instructions say to file an issue here at github.com slash dragonfruit network slash onion fruit slash issues. Why are we going on so many bunny rabbit trails today? We've, like, we did the, what was the name of the book earlier? Oh, it's like... The Erathia or Ur Ur Urania? Hold Eurasia on. or something like that. Hold on. Um, Urantia. Urantia. <clears throat> From Wikipedia, the text introduced the text of the Book of Urantia introduces the word Urantia as the name of the planet Earth and states that its intent is to present enlarged concepts and advance truth. The book aims to unite religion, science, and philosophy. Its large amount of content on topics of interest to science is unique among documents said to have been received from celestial beings. <laughs> among other topics, the book discusses the origin and meaning of life, mankind's place in the universe, the history of the planet, the relationship between God and people, and the life of Jesus. This is a book that uh, we learned was uh, recorded from the sleeping mumblings of a dude who thought he was encountering the real-life equivalent of G-Man from Half-Life. And... Somehow, this book does two things. One, it's actually really good. Like, apparently it is a very compelling read, even for people who think that it's bullshit. And two, has not inspired... It's not... No, there aren't any cults that have <laughs> yeah. come out of it. There is no, like, organization... Like, there's no organization that sells the book. But there's not, like, a cult or a religion that has arisen out of this book. Sometimes people get together to have study groups to look at this book and be like, this is some dope shit. But otherwise, there's no cult of Urantia. It's just a book. And I kind of want to read it because, like, the one dude said that it was, like, this really... The, who's, like, uh, fairly... Uh, like well-read, well-respected, uh, skeptic, and uh, so forth, has said that like the fourth chapter, there's like three chap like sections of it, and the fourth section is just like a narrative about the life of Jesus, and the dude was like, this narrative kicks ass, <laughs> like w this is really well written. I'm like, I want to read it just to find out like what it what this deal is uh he said that like the first three were like some of the best science fiction world building he's ever read <laughs> like i want to read it and we discovered this because we suddenly were like wait what was the name what were the name of the 12 apostles the of 12 jesus again yeah. and i just google searched it it was literally the first result took me to their page was from the book of Urantia's website. And at first, I just read through the list, right? And I was like, okay, it was this guy, this guy. And I get down to Judas Iscariot, and I'm like, read him off. And then while me and Ark are kind of talking, I'm like idly reading it, and I'm going over it, and I'm like, I don't remember this much detail about Judas's past being revealed in the Bible. Yeah, this is an awful lot about Judas, like his childhood and shit. Like, I don't remember the part of the Bible where it says he was born to rich fucking parents that spoiled him like assholes. Like, I'm pretty sure the extent of who Judas was, was he fucked Jesus over the end. <laughs> <laughs> like, they didn't talk about him a whole lot in the Bible. They're like, he fucked Jesus over, he got a bunch of silver, and he was like, oh no, the silver is like, Like, bad. he got, like, the only other thing I can think of that was really, like, 
noted in the Bible was the time that a woman came and was like, I'll wash your feet, Jesus. And Judas was like, no, that's a waste of good oil. And Jesus was like, shut the fuck up, Judas. And he was like, oh, I will have you killed later. <laughs> <laughs> like you do. <laughs> like you do. Guys in chat, do you remember that time that you were really nice to me? And I was like, no, fuck you. And then you were like, I will have him... I'll sell him out to the Romans <laughs> later this year. <laughs> like you do. <laughs> uh, so. So how's your cocktail going? Uh, it goes. Ow! My <laughs> eye! Why? Just the fumes for my cup. Decided they didn't like my eyeball anymore. Yeah, don't have your cup in your face for too long. Well, I'm discovering with this because it's... It's not a good hard liquor cup because it does this. Yeah, it you does something want... that's a lot better for things that are like... You want to get like that aromatic... Like wine. Alright, hot take? I think that's a terrible design for brandy. Like, I've had brandy in those like brandy-ass... <laughs> things where it's like the whoop and it like, it's designed to like funnel all the brandy directly into your nose and it's terrible Alvin the chipmunks generally cause pain to one's face that is true you know what though if we say that the eyes are the face the effects the, 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 the CGI in the Alvin and the chipmunks movies the CG ones are the best part about those movies. I haven't actually seen the movies because the I looked one, at them and I said, fuck that. In the first one, they're okay, but in the later ones, they really dialed it in. It looks pretty fucking decent. I'm not upset at the effects in those. They look cute. Uh, they're well, they, you know, they, they're expressive. I can see what they're doing. They're, they got good motion. It doesn't look weird. Uh, I feel like the special effects animators for those movies did a rock solid job. Good on you. Well done. Good job. Why do you the... have to do it with live action at all, ever? Yeah. And even then, the thing that really killed it was the script. The scripts are garbage. It's it's and that tends to be the effect. That tends to be the case with so many of these movies. Is like the special effects artists are working their goddamn asses off trying to make it look halfway decent and they're just working with terrible scripts and so and because of that people walk away from the movie thinking wow what a piece of shit this movie was and the and the uh, special effects artists are like uh you know i feel like it's more rare to see a movie with bad special effects than it is to see in like proper theaters yeah as a because like i've the seen flash of movie woof <laughs> The fucking babies of the Flash movie. Like, those effects felt like they were, like, 20 years old. Like, I would have expected those baby effects in a movie in a video game from 10 years ago. It was bad. <laughs> also, I'm sorry I disagree because, uh... I take great umbrage with the character design in the sequels because they look too much like actual chipmunks and not at all like generic mammal things. <laughs> yeah, I liked in the in the animated films where they were just sort of grayish, like they were beige creatures. things. They could be they could be groundhogs. They could be squirrels. <laughs> Maybe a bit of beaver in there. Who knows? Whatever you're feeling like when you watch it. Do some weed and get back to us. It's called Alvin the Chipmunks, but chipmunks is only a suggestion here. Yeah, it's it's a relative term. You know, chipmunks are what you feel in the moment. <laughs> <laughs> Alvin and the other two squeaky fuzz blobs. <laughs> See, that's, that's where religions come from. It's like, chipmunks are what you feel. Like, what do you feel chipmunks are? That's why they're so blobby. <laughs> well, is so that they can be whatever you feel in the moment. People in Fallout, they feel like dinner. <laughs> <laughs> then they are dinner. <laughs> Please give us money. Here's the tithe plate. <laughs> 
here in the church of chipmunk we think firstly and foremost of you <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Uh, but yeah, like, what was the movie? Oh, Nut Job was the movie where I got done watching it. I was like, wow, that animation was fucking solid as shit. That movie sucked ass, though. <laughs> <laughs> like, I know. I hope my kids didn't like this movie because otherwise I'm going to watch it for like years. <laughs> but, like, really good animation terrible script that tends to be the case for a lot of like products that are created artist first see an artist that's another reason they know why... how to write a comic and they don't that's another reason why i don't i can't be a father because they those kids would watch something that's like technically harmless but i thought was re what i thought was bad and I'd be like, you kids aren't watching that anymore. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to hurt your brain. I don't want your brains to, like, deteriorate. And, like, I, I want to try... I'd try to be open-minded about that, because I'm certain there were lots of stuff that I watched as a kid that my dad was like, oh, that's the stupidest shit. Dragon Ball Z! <laughs> like, you guys are fucking morons. But, you know what? Whatever. But funny. on the other hand, I also want to be on the lookout for stuff that I think is actually brain rotting. <laughs> like, stuff that I'm like... Like, don't ruin your palettes and your expectations for future products. Like, like Dragon don't, Ball Z! Don't dull it down to this level. Because <laughs> you're going to watch Nut Job, and then you're going to watch, like the Smurfs movie and be like, whoa, this is such a good movie because all you've had is nut job. We, we also, whose fucking are. idea was it to call something that you give to kids nut, nut job? job. <laughs> Look, we are where we are today because a whole generation of kids thought He-Man was cool. If you thought He-Man was cool, you're why the country is the way it is. <laughs> I Bold said statement. it. <laughs> it's your fault. Nobody here likes Heath, man. <laughs> they're all either our they're all either our age or younger. <laughs> <laughs> this is the episode where you drink a lot and get canceled. <laughs> <laughs> we don't play any video games. We're just like, you know what? Let's have a conversation with the audience. And get ourselves in trouble. Oh, hey, Craden puts on the strangling gloves uh -oh. for us. Craden likes he man. Uh oh. What? Time to get in a fight with chat. Why, why do you like he man? Yeah, why though? <laughs> like, are you young? Are you a lot older than we think you are? Like, to like, to like he man, you have to be like five gay dudes crammed into one gay dude. That's it. Never mind. Can't never mind that image. <laughs> Why? It sounds like you meant perfectly. <laughs> Five. Okay. Oh. <laughs> uh, I do like Skeletor. That's true. He Ske is. He is the surviving mean character, beloved by all people. What about Snarf though? Was it? Snarf. I thought. I thought. Snarf. Wasn't he man master? Wasn't he master of the universe? No, wasn't he Thundercats? Yeah, he was, was Thundercats. He Thundercats. Fuck. I didn't. I was a child of the '90s. I wasn't really like sentient until like '91, and then go on from there. So like '80s shit, like He Man and Transformers, wasn't really my jam. Like. The most 80s ass shit that I watched was like the Disney Afternoon, right? Because that was in reruns when I was a little kid. And then after that, like, what kicked off? Uh, like, Warner Brothers shit? Like, Tiny Toons, Animaniacs, X Men, uh, Batman, Spider Man, Spider Man, the Mega Man cartoon. The Mega Man cartoon. <laughs> like, that was my jam. I, was, I wasn't there for like. For like He Man, He Man at Orco. That's the one. Uh, Pirates of Dark Water. Shortly, dude. Okay, if it's you want such see... a shame about that show, 
that had such an amazing pilot in first few episodes and like, then like the first it got, season i think was good first season maybe two seasons i don't even think it made it through a whole season like it got a, fir- a, a pilot a pilot and a couple episodes that were like oh man this is so great and like a pilot and then it's season, just sort of dropped and then got canceled because it was a Hanna barbera cartoon this the pilot got all their money and they're like yeah roll with it and then they got handed to Hanna barbera Hanna barbera and now they're like walking sideways towards the camera it's so sad like i really would love to s- that's a show that should get like a netflix reboot because it's such a good premise and the characters are interesting and the idea nobody's done that idea like the the you know the epitomous dark water that yeah just, i don't know i don't even think the we gems? learned what it was it was yeah. just evil water that would just devour your boats like the fucking tar pits if you've never watched uh, Dark Water. What was it? The Pirates of Dark Water. Yep, Pirates of Dark Water. If you never watched the Pirates of Dark Water, watch it. Starring generic anime, uh, generic Western anime the anime guy was good in and the generic Western anime, not damsel in distress, but heroine. Yes, yeah, and then a, a cast, heroine. and then a cast of actually interesting, well-designed characters. Like the fucking main pirate villain. It had a swear that actually worked. How many shows have you seen introduce like a fake swear where you're like, this sounds so fucking stupid, but Noise Tot sounds great. That's a good fake I didn't swear. remember that at all. Noise Tot? Oh, that was such a good swear. I but yeah, like the main pirate antagonist. Like I remember him. Uh Bloth. 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 And then of course you have our your friend the monkey bird. The monkey bird? Dude, that shows how good a show it was that we haven't seen that in like a decade. And we still remember all this shit. Like, what a good cartoon that could have been. And then it got handed to Hannah Barbera. Uh, stream is reconnecting. Uh oh. Did we lose internet? Did we lose internet? Uh, we're live now. We're live now. We alive? Did we get disconnected? And now we're live again and we're not losing shit? What the fuck happened? Alright, well. Just ate shit and died. Ate shit and died. Cool beans. So how much did you guys lose? Did you, how much of our conversation about this amazing cartoon did you lose? No, oh, well, we can't do anything until uh, Crane's ad is over, so just sit and st- oh, yeah. just, just stone hang. still silence. Just relax. You know, if you subscribe, you don't get ads. I said stone silence. Oh, sorry. Family feud pose. What's that? Like a JoJo pose? (laughs) Stay away from me, Steve Harvey. (laughs) I know what you do in the commercial breaks. (laughs) You You thought it was Drew Carey, but instead it's me, Dio. I know. Dun, 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 I just dun, dun, imagine dun. Colin looking over like what the fuck, <laughs> <laughs> Ryan. Um, Gargoyles was a pretty good show. I like that one. Yeah. Um, so, but yeah, God, Pirates of Dark Water was such a good, like it was a good premise. It was a good, like the animation was good. The. Uh. The characters were good. Like, how many cartoons at that time had, like, a really strong female character? Who wasn't just, like, a token strong female character, you know what I mean? The Legend of Zelda cartoon. Reboot. Reboot? It was the 90s. Nothing was being rebooted yet. No, reboot. The, oh, show. The, the show reboot. I didn't really watch reboot. I thought reboot looked like shit even at the time. Power Rangers. True. Okay. Power Rangers did have Kimberly and just Asian Kimberly. Girl. <laughs> Asian, Asian girl. She was 90 years old. She was Asian girl. <laughs> Let me drink more. No. 
<laughs> Slept. Uh, Trini. Yeah, Trini. T R I N I. Trini. That was her name. She Are was you the, sure? She was the Yellow Ranger. Yeah. Because of course she was a fucking Yellow Ranger. <laughs> what the hell was wrong with everybody in the nineties? <laughs> I want a version of Power Rangers where it's played by where the characters are played by people like Wayne Brady so we can get that why moment. I gotta be the Black Ranger why do I gotta go in the black suit <laughs> like mm, Inspector Gadget dude I, I miss Inspector Gadget <laughs> That part of the theme song where they just farted and gave up and went home. Because, <laughs> like, I know, look, I know it's kind of a trope at this point to be like, oh, this was evidence of racism, but, like, the, the Native American guy was the Red Ranger, the Black guy was the Black Ranger, the girl was the pink ranger uh no trini wasn't the original group wasn't she yeah because she was the yellow ranger yeah the one who was added later was the irish guy as the green as ranger, the green ranger. <laughs> he did get changed to the white ranger later after he gave <laughs> up on being fucking um a, a bad guy what's his name from punch out <laughs> oh yeah aaron ryan yeah. <laughs> like like woof. <laughs> it it was bad, okay? Like it wasn't the kind of thing that kids would notice. But like if you were to try to roll out that crew today, like that that show would not make it past the pilot. They'd be like, "Excuse me. <laughs> Hold on." Like, there are definitely some things where I can be like, okay, Twitter is really overreacting, but not Power Rangers. Power Rangers, it was really obvious. It's also hilarious. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> also hilarious that we didn't ever put the dots together until someone went on, like, <laughs> went on the internet and said, hey, did anyone else notice this? And we we're like, oh my god. We were being and racismed. <laughs> hey, at least we weren't having at least we weren't having a Mr. Popo moment. We weren't going back and being like, oh my god, are you allowed? <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh man. Dude, what are some other cartoons in the 90s? That, like, just you wish had been a more of a thing. Uh, you were like, oh, this is sick. And then they just never really went anywhere with it. Problem is, what things were actually things also kind of depended on your area. Because, mm. like, certain shows just weren't played some places. Like, I remember Freakazoid wasn't that, oh, yeah, yeah. wasn't that prevalent wherever we lived. But it was, Freakazoid was good. It was, that was good shit. Uh, Freakazoid felt like, um... Oh yeah, bonkers. I love that cop. <laughs> I also really like the cop from Freakazoid because he is the most deadpan snarker. Yeah. And they were just like, you know what? All the adult jokes will come from this man. <laughs> um... Eek the cat. I thought you might mention Eek. Yeah. Eek had Eek did have a really good intro theme. There are a lot of shows that had intro themes that were way better than they deserved to be. Tasmania. Tasmania. Dilbert. Dilbert, I think, is the king of that. It's like, the as cartoon. Show was, eh, but my god, the the intro theme for Dilbert. Now By I kinda Danny wanna Elfman. just now I kinda wanna just pull up YouTube videos of like these intro themes. <laughs> Welcome Yo, to Vibe Stream. Seriously, fuck this game. Let's play Wizards and Warriors. 
No, because Wizards and Warriors, I hate playing more than Ocarina of Time. <laughs> Wizards and Warriors are pain. Oh yeah, the Earthworm Jim cartoon. I don't remember really seeing Earthworm Jim. I was able to catch a few episodes. It was one of those cartoons that you didn't really see around our area. It's like when the Donkey Kong Country cartoon, that was one where the networks were just like, yeah, we don't want this. Donkey, the Donkey Kong cartoon was like, even at the time I thought this was trash. Like there's some cartoons where like in hindsight, you look at them and you're like, wow, I was a stupid kid. And then there's some cartoons where even at the time, as a stupid kid, you're like, this is terrible. I'll cover you in coconut cream pies. <laughs> you're like, I don't want to watch You know, for kids. <laughs> I don't want to watch this. The tech. The Wait, tech which was... one? Because, I mean, I know they were both good, and but some people like more than the others. For us, it was it's the cartoon. cartoon show. Dum dwee, dum Patrick dum Patrick dum Warburton dum. as the tech was also a good choice. Yes. <laughs> Solid choice. <laughs> Peter. Not upset about that. <laughs> Spoot! Yeah. Um, Cartoon. Fucking American made. What? <laughs> Mwah. Mwah. Perfect. <laughs> I like how she was the most competent hero. Yeah. Like, Where people talk a lot about... People talk about... Uh, people talk a lot about Hollywood. And what a great play that was by Bojack. <laughs> but the fucking chair face moon <laughs> with the cha. Like every episode after that, there's just cha on the moon. The moon. <laughs> that was fucking amazing. Beautiful consistency. Never got into cat dog. Yeah, that was one of, like, there's a lot of Nick Tunes like, that were kind of like that, where it's like some time. of them were like, oh man, I love this show. And others that I was like, I don't jive with this. Yeah. Um, Cartoon Network too, mm -hmm. like uh, with Nicktoons. I never got into Johnny Bravo. Like Nicktoons was Angry Beavers, uh, Invader Zim much later in like the early two thousands, yeah. but like in the nineties it was uh, Angry Beavers. I was into Doug, Doug, like Doug. Um, Rugrats too, a little. <sighs> I really wasn't. Did like all real monsters. All real monsters. But that's because I thought that the uh class Klasky Supo what Klasko Su Klasky Sco Scoopo. Whatever the fuck that was. That company that really worked for all real monsters. Yes. Anytime they tried to draw humans, it was terrible. Like uh, when they did uh Thornberries like Yeah, I know I know some people like really like Thornberries and I'm just like no. I mean I don't, they're, Nigel is certain. Nigel, I think, is the um, Skeletor of he's that like show. He's like the king of memes. Yeah, he's the he's the meme standout that is stuck himself into everyone's hearts. Oh, Recess! I did like Recess. I never got into Recess. I, I thought Recess it was a bit because it it felt like real. Like I I could like I could like connect with the characters. Oh, and let's not forget Ren and Stimpy. Ren and Stimpy. The show no, that, granted, that the show was that kind of like this drink, and that I was constantly looking at it and going, I'm not sure if I like this or not. Sometimes because, it was very obvious that I don't like this. And like, you know, like I remember one episode that always freaked me out was the one where they went to space. Oh yeah. Not Dude. not like the not the not the Russian moon one. Okay, because that, that was hilarious. Was amazing. The one where they went to an actual alien planet, and I was like, <laughs> just freaked out. Like the best Sorry. scene of that was just the guy getting carried off. No, you want the no, dog? The dog. <laughs> and you just see in the background the miss the missile that there's gonna set up. And you just hear no, no. <laughs> While well, they're just sitting there with these stupid happy expressions, like. <laughs> like waiting to go. Ding! Oh, it's our turn ski. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh yeah, Bobby's World. Bobby's World. That was Fox. Do, 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 do. That, that was, was Fox. That was Fox. Fox had its own. Collection Fox of was goods. Fox was where Eek was. Yep. Fox also had uh, the best superhero the shows. Fox had the Tick. Fox had the Tick. It, it had, had X Men, X Men, Spider and Spider Man, and Mega Man. Okay, you say the best superhero shows, but the best superhero show was. Objectively, oh yeah, Batman, Batman, Good and old that Warner was Brothers. Warner Brothers. Batman holds up still today, and they followed it up later with uh, Batman Beyond, yep. which was also great. Very, very solid stuff. Mo a lot of people still believe that the 
that Batman the Animated Series is the best Batman that has ever batman Like, it was exactly what Batman is. Like, it, if there's anything that... If there's... If you want to describe Batman, Batman the Animated Series is exactly Batman. So, and I, I personally, I think that I agree. I think if somebody want, asked me, like if aliens showed up and said, hey, what is Batman? I'd be like, watch the animated series. That is exactly Batman. Mark Hamill's the Joker. Yeah, Mark Hamill's the Joker. Um, oh, what's his name? I'm so mad at myself now. Kevin Spacey. Yes. <laughs> As Batman. <laughs> um, he's passed on now, which is sad. Aww. But uh, he in my he was just the best Batman. Mark Hamill's the best Joker. Um, and I'm sorry. What's his name is the best Riddler? I'm sorry, but everyone knows that the best Mario. Is Captain Lou Albano. Yes. Agreed. I love you, Charles Martinet. I love you. <laughs> but no one will ever be as good as fucking Deep Bronx Mario. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best Mario that has ever Mario. Luigi! Luigi! Kevin Conroy, thank you. Kevin Conroy. Rest in peace. Thank you for giving us the best Batman. Um... Got 90 shows, dude. I mean, yeah, then we had, you know, then of course, there was Dick, Dick. which we uh, didn't yes. get to really watch a lot of Dick because we didn't have cable for a no, lot of No, but our we childhood. did have, we did have, we did have Dick and we did have, got, we did get to see Saban. So Saban. Dick is where we got, we got to watch Power Rangers. Uh, Samurai Pizza Cats, yep. which is still one of my favorite all-time childhood shows. Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon. Uh, the beginnings of most anime, really. Like yep. I think we first watched Dragon Ball Z for a brief period back during the great big green dub. <laughs> uh, you say Deke, but they always pronounced it Dick. I've looked up every single... Uh, oh, the Sonic the Hedgehog! Oh, Saddam! Yes! Not the other one, which is great now for different reasons. Yeah. <laughs> what? I will say. Me? So tales. I love you. I love. I love you, Jim Cummings. You did a great Robotnik. Beautiful Robotnik. You are not that you other are dude. <laughs> that other dude gave it like seven thousand percent. Rest in peace, that dude. What was his name? That was Long John <laughs> Silver. No, like he he was like he was actually called like Long John something. Like his last name was Beery or Beery or something mm -hmm. like that. Okay. But he had a great to the point where I have one of my characters in this story I have being developed. Yep. And I was looking at him. He does not look like Robotnik or any way, shape at all, but I was like, I want <gasps> It's a kobold. I want I want a voice for him that is as dynamic and filled with range as yep. Doctor Robotnik from the terrible Sonic the Hedgehog okay, cartoon. You know what? I'm looking up that music video. I'm just what? doing it. You know I can't Doctor really Doctor. listen to that in the car anymore. Really? How come? Because for whatever reason, the like slapping sound that ch -ch 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 is. Ear piercingly loud. Really? Yeah. Huh. Oh, and Baldrick, too. Oh, hey, Baldrick. Welcome. We got the wizard and the kobold. Yeah, this is crazy. One's a wizard, the other's a kobold. Will they get along in the suburbs? <laughs> <laughs> Why the suburbs, though? <laughs> Dude, you guys get to see, uh, here, home. You guys get to see what YouTube thinks that I would like. Ready? What the fuck is this shit, Tom Scott? Billionaires, what went wrong? Carl Sagan, Steve 1989, Steve Mold, whatever this shit is, Corridor Crew, uh, Outside Xbox, Extra History, Ashens. I haven't watched Ashens in a hot minute. Yeah. 
Linus um, <laughs> that uh, we are not alive is a bit sus. Squint. <laughs> you like furry stuff, right? <laughs> Honest, honestly, this is the first time they've ever suggested anything furry even adjacent to me. I have no idea who this is. He's a liberal redneck. Interview between Late Show and John Oliver? That's just like a leftist circle jerk. <laughs> <laughs> More uh, Carl Sagan. Fr we got some friendly Geordies over here. Spiffing Brit. A ah, bit Spiff. Frank? I don't know. I've never heard of them. We got some Smooth But Groove. Peter Whitten? Never heard of them. 2.5 million views. They're popular, though. Natural hey, that one habitat. has tits on it. Where? 16-bit oh, horror. Never heard of them. Got some uh, Loaded Ready Run here. They're a good channel. Watch them. Let's just go scroll down and be like, here are all the channels that you should watch instead of us. Hey, butt reveal. Nice. Toonsy. They just did a Markiplier video. That re that uh, animated video about condoms that just I don't think I that saw just that one. Dropped. Uh, that was Toonsy. but with food sauce. What? Where? What? Corridor oh. crew. <laughs> okay, we're not going to do the thing on Twitch <laughs> where we just react to videos. We're not doing that. <laughs> that's People are getting in trouble for that. We're not doing that anymore. Uh, one guy's getting in trouble for it, and that's because he XQC? didn't actually do... An oh, act yeah, He didn't do actual reactions. Well, he's also an asshole. Yeah. He does that thing where someone is like, hey, you're kind of doing an ash hole thing, and he just buries himself in a hole. <laughs> yeah. Like, he literally just walks away from the room. He's like, I don't need to pause this. I'll just leave. <laughs> don't even set it to anything. Hydraulic press channel, where was that? Was that You've never here? seen that? Oh, I've seen it. Oh, there it is. Hydraulic press channel. I love this channel. The lithium so bat. Satisfying. Why? Stop playing with your lives. It's so. Is this new? Have I not seen this? Vlad the Impaler versus Count Dracula. Have I not seen that? I mean, you might not have seen a number of them. Beautiful. Brian David Gilbert. Never heard of them. Donut. I've become very interested in Donut lately. Some more news by uh, uh Cody. What's his name? I think so. I think Cody from... Discovered him from uh, College Humor. This is here because I've been working on a parody rap of the Gangsta the Killer and the Dope Dealer. And now we're getting into territory where it's like, here we have the Food Theorist, which I'm not interesting... I'm not interested in the Theory Channel anymore because of how they treated Austin... Who is right here, actually, ShoddyCast. Go go subscribe to ShoddyCast, please. If you liked the old The Science Of videos from the Game Theory channels, uh, they completely shafted him and booted him off their channel. He's at ShoddyCast now. Go follow him. He does cool stuff. Um, Code Bullet. Love Code Bullet. Uh... Again, Steve Mold. Flash Glitz? Never heard of them. It looks Fresh like an Farm. animation group. Never heard of them. GameSpot. That's GameSpot. Fucking. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles channel? They have their own channel? It's live. Here we have Gamers Nexus being angry at Linus Tech Tips. Because views. Uh, Big Balls Mix. Because I'm. Okay. There's a furry recommendation. There we you got go. there. I would really like to do How to a drink. mix of. I would really I like to do channel. a remix of hey, of uh, Sorry Jack by them. I really like that song. How to drink? Player. How to drink? Uh, I'm sad I didn't get to participate in that one because I had an idea for it. The idea was you like sent him. The name of a drink with one word changed. Oh. That's why he's got a cilantro julep. But my idea... Let's see if I can't All find right. the cocktail that I started with. Alright, I need to... Sorry, I need to do a thing. I need to just admit what this is now. No, we're gonna start gaming soon. I wanna start playing game. Okay.
What was it I was gonna play? I was gonna play What'll It Be? That's what All I right. came here to play. Which I'm sure people have seen at this point. Surely they have seen this at this point. Now don't forget to pause iTunes. Well, I gotta switch okay, over to I can't mode. find the drink anymore, but there was something that was made with Tabasco in it. Why? And, well, Bloody Mary mix has Tabasco in it oh, sometimes. Oh, for fuck's sake. Clop, clop, clop. Go the fuck away. We'll load you up again in a hot second. Um. What would it be? So crazy. What would it be? Anyway, continue. So there is a cocktail. There's a number of cocktails with Tabasco sauce in it, but one of them is um, had tabac Tabasco in the name. Like, I don't know, Tabasco, Tabasco gin float or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, what if I had sent him that, but replaced Tabasco? With tobacco. Oh no! <laughs> Tell me now before I change my mind. Why let me? This song has no business being this good. What? Why let me? See, I love the fact that his voice can go from like that deep, rich tone to. Why let me? Yeah. <laughs> Waiting. See, the thing is, we could get here. You and I both have this kind of talent. We just need to, like, actually not be ashamed of ourselves and just give it 110%. But we never do because we're always, like, bashful. <laughs> A chili dog! Give me some of this, babe. Like, I feel like we would be our best at voice acting with some juice in us. You know, where it's like, we don't, we don't give a shit what people think. We're just like, oh, this is a line where I have to just fucking rip it? Let's go. Right? Win uh, the race? Speaking of voice actors who gave it all in when they absolutely did not need to. Uh, the Team Four Star doing those boo bits. Oh, yeah. The bit with Vegeta. Yeah. And Vegeta, it was like... yes! <laughs> it's like that dude dialed up so much higher than he needed to, but it and, was perfect. Yeah. So I guess you could argue that he dialed it up exactly as much as he needed to. Because if he had dialed it up less, it wouldn't have been as perfect. <laughs> what? Why let me? <laughs> the Vegeta... The dude who did Vegeta... Look, if you want to see Dragon Ball Z up to, like, what? when did they stop? Uh, end of Cell Saga. End of Cell Saga? Don't watch the actual show. Watch the watch the team four star uh, Dragon Ball Z Bridge. It's the same exact storyline, but funny and uh, short. <laughs> like, um, it's. I will also say. I will. I will say in fairness, there's some characters in that. Like, I love most of the voice acting in DBZ Abridged. Um, obviously, Vegeta, top tier. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Mas Masako X is, right. like, the Goku that I now hear in my head all the time. Like, I think of a Goku line, I hear Masako. But I still like the... Funimation Goku too. I hear him too. Mm -hmm. Um, but I also prefer Team Four Stars Piccolo infinitely more than right. Base Piccolo. We're just putting on music while. Um, but with Krillin, it's also another fifty-fifty. Right. I love Base Krillin, but I love Team Four Star Krillin. It's true. 
But of course, new one. the best voice in all of Team Four Star is Mr. Popo. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> it's one of those things where it's like, if, if you have to watch one, watch DBZA, right? You know, it's just, it's the same sort of thing as like, if, um, I had a person who was telling me, I had a friend who was telling me like, I've been thinking about playing Final Fantasy. I was like, play the, play the Pixel Remaster. Don't worry about the NES version at this point. The NES version is just like, if you're, if you have, it's, it's like historical curiosity at this point, right? Like where I, I want to see what it was like on the NES. I don't care if it's a good game. I just want to see what it was like. That's when you play the NES version. If you want to play FF1 in the best possible light, putting its best foot forward, play the Pixel Remaster. It's got the best music. It's got the best mechanics. They've dealt with all the issues. Um, I love... That is one of my favorite jokes in the DBZ Abridged, is the voices in Piccolo's head. And that also brings me to one aspect that I kind of wish could happen for the series as a whole, which is I wish they could go back and remaster the old episodes yeah. with, the, with the modern cast. Because you go back and you and maybe like modern writing too, you watch yeah. them do their little uh, commentaries on each of their episodes, and there are certain jokes that they regret. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Things where they're like... Maybe we wouldn't have said retard so many times. <laughs> Although, to be fair... Like, I, I, I've i said that, you know, it was always a character that you would expect to hear say that. Yeah. Like, someone like Vegeta. You never yeah. heard anyone like Krillin. Hi, either. I'm Goku. What a fucking retard. Like, it wouldn't have flown, right. I don't think. And... Which... Um... I think they said they would keep that one. <laughs> Yeah. Just because of the bait and switch. Right. It's like, Krillin, what? A freaky alien genotype. Oh, I thought you were calling him a derogatory term for a homosexual. That guy, that that thing's a guy? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah. Um, but like, you know, those joke, like the ones with retard in it, or right. there's some other ones that they were... There were some other ones that were they thought were just cringy. Yeah. Um, but also like some of the voice actors changed for the better considerably. Yeah. Vegeta, I think. Well, Vegeta's improved. been the same guy. Right, but he improved his delivery, I think. Yeah. Um, but the two I'm in particular I'm thinking of are yeah, Yamcha. Change. Yamcha. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Kami. Mm-hmm. Because Yamcha started and they started trying to do with that. Yamcha is a surfer dude. Oh. Yeah, he was just fucking. Uh, he was. Papyrus. He was just. Oh. Cloud from Final Fantasy VII. Oh. And, uh. Kami, you go back and you watch his old stuff and he's like. Hello, I'm Kami! <laughs> I'm so lonely! And now he's no. just like. Hold on, I thrashed my throat. <laughs> Jesus you Christ. You thrashed your throat with one line? Oh that is God. so hard to do. <laughs> it is so hard to do that voice. That's one reason why they probably changed it, was like, doing that voice for a long time was worse than the nights I had to voice act entire B scripts. Poor B. Um, but like, they changed it later to where he's now just more of a... Real, uh, snarky, deep-voiced old man. That voice right. is perfect. Yeah. But you know whose voice has always been perfect? Who? Yajirobe. That's true. And they didn't even change that. Yep. <laughs> That's just how he sounded. <laughs> Aren't you gonna fly after them? No. <laughs> is it because you're fat? Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of comedy that's just like I don't know it I've I've always believed that if you aren't pissing somebody off you're not doing comedy right you should you should be always like right on the edge 
of just like absolutely fucking someone off. And if you're not, you're not doing comedy right. Something. King Kai was spot on. I love King. Like. <laughs> just how absolutely fed up with everything he was. <laughs> like, the thing about... Ah, that's George Takei. He somehow made this into a three-way. <laughs> oh my... Call! Three-way call! <laughs> Let's play some, like, actual Zelda. It's oh, past 11. Sake. All right. <laughs> I've just been having a really good time just, like, chilling out and chatting. This has been nice. We should do this more often. <laughs> Shut up, Bojack! <laughs> All right, all right. I like all right. how that was their solution to the whole BoJack movie that they did not want to do. <laughs> Why is this full screen? Fucking. All right, all right. So we're going to do some. We're going to do some game, I guess. God. All right, so we need to choose some randomizer settings here. Uh. I can't see the randomizer settings because these fuckwads will not w refuse. They keep saying that they can't. It's like bullshit. But they refuse. Look, they've even made it so you can dock the fucking settings, but you can't change the size. I can't even see what these say. <laughs> Here. So we're going to make them like fucking insane. I think this What's is. The, where's the randomizer settings that make the game fun? They don't, those don't exist. It's Ocarina. Gameplay. Oh, you have the mouse? Yes. Um, all right, so first of all, uh, you need to go to items, I think. Items. Um, shuffle cows. Shuffle Gerudo card. Right, token sanity on. Uh, token sanity. Uh, all tokens. All tokens. Every single token. Uh, songs are already fine. Shop sanity turns to all of them. Uh, ran, uh, four items. Four items. Right. Shop sanity prices. Uh, tycoon's wallet. Because that is, that is the madness. Uh, scrub shuffle. Uh, expense is fine. Uh, shuffle cows. Be honest. Shuffle cat. Shuffle cows. Uh, shuffle merchants on. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, shuffle adult trade. No. Hundred gold skull tallas. Are we that mad right now? That I think that's technically easier than just beating the game. Shuffle dungeon rewards to everywhere. Anywhere. Maps, compasses, start with, that's fine. Skull, yeah. small, keys, small keys, anywhere. anywhere. Right. Key, Key rings. rings, off. Right. Grotto Valley Fortress map? I don't know what that is. Why? Why did he punch me in the dick? Why did I explode? Wait, does TTS still work? It sure does. Wait for it. Sure does. Is that say boss keys? Yes. Uh, anywhere. Oops, 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 oops. Anywhere. Ganon's boss key. Anywhere. anywhere. Uh, Baldrick would like to suggest max ice traps, one hit KO mode. I watched Simple Flips do that. Like, it was funny at first, but it got old real fast. Um, Kaku's return. That doesn't feel madness. Oh, here we go. Uh, that doesn't feel madnessy. That just feels obnoxious. <laughs> That's a good question. Gossip stone hands. That Item was for balance. Ice my dick. Traps. Go to ice traps. Can we make ice traps? Ice traps right now is extra. Do mayhem. Mayhem. You, it's still extra. I told it mayhem. Try mayhem. Mayhem. There we go, mayhem. Perfect. Uh, that's fine. Uh, where's damage? Um, that's in the enhancement section. That's not in the randomizer. Oh. So, uh, at this point, I think we're good. Okay. In terms of madness. So you'll just have to change all these settings in your... Can we not well. copy 
No. Nope. Like a uh, seed nope. or settings nope. key or whatever, nope. like you can in literally every other randomizer. What is wrong with you people? I mean, we could copy the JSON over, but if that's a huge pain in the ass. It's more of a pain in the ass to just. How do I open the settings? Click on your screen so that yours is active. It is active. Here you go. go open the randomizer on the far right there. Is there a setting to randomize the randomizer settings? Uh, there isn't a very a randomizer, but not this one. So, what did we do again? I don't know. You have to click it. Uh. Shuffle Gerudo card. Shop Sanity. What, why is it doing that? Because it's weird. They don't Four have items. a very good... They don't have a very good UI. Tycoon's wallet. Okay. Uh, Shuffle cows. cows. Shuffle merchants on. With hints, right. Shuffle... Anywhere up at the top. Shuffle dungeon rewards should be anywhere. Anywhere. To be fair to these devs, though, I don't imagine that they looked at this as a potential option there. Key rings off. I saw that custom co model, Cobalt. That's really cool. We're working on new custom models for uh, for the 10th anniversary, which is next year, by the way. I hope you're excited for that. Anywhere. We're going to be doing all kinds of randomizers next year. It'll be in May. We're going to be doing... We're going to be doing Final Fantasy, Ocarina, Zelda stuff, Metroid stuff, what uh, Mario stuff, everything where... Uh, Spelunky stuff, everything where we've done custom stuff over the years, we're going to be doing that. We're also going to be doing some new stuff, too, that we're working on right now. So I hope that you will be there. It'll be like a subathon, donation-a-thon, all that kind of stuff. I hope that you will be there. It should be a lot of fun. We're hoping to do this. As near as I can tell, we should... If you could turn down just a hair, please, Zelda. We're looking to do this, except... As near as I could tell, you can do this with as many people as you want. So we'll be doing this, except you can join in and play too. So it should be a ton of fun. I hope that you'll be there for us. Be there for us. Be there with us, but also for us in May of next year, which is our 10th anniversary. Because I looked it up. We posted our first video on YouTube in May of 2014. So that's our 10th anniversary. One... What? I need vape. Oh. Is your vape dead or did you just not bring it? I didn't bring it. Oh. I can go get it. Um. Did we change anything else? Besides ice traps? No. Not not to the right of this. A starting inventory should be our... Should be the Kokiri sword. Start with consumables, yes. Start with Kokiri sword, yes. Okay, good. Do you want us to not start with a Kokiri sword? I let's, mean, that's more madness. Let's not take it too far. Dude, you made it so that it's Gold Skull Tola tokens. It's already the most madness of madness. So let's not take it too far. <laughs> Is everything else the same? I think so. So, generate randomizer? Yes. Be prepared for it to crash. It crashed. Mine's okay. So just start yours up again. And hopefully it won't crash this time. But it's gonna do this. Are the settings... The uh, same. Just go to items and see if it's right. It says shuffle songs anywhere. All tokens. Just hit generate randomizer and see what it does. Oh, right. But you got to set the seed. Oh, right. I didn't have to set your seed. You know, well, just, here, you take over. 
let's do let's do chum let's type it correctly chum bucket will be today's seed generate randomizer don't crash okay and manual seed entry. That might be why it crashed. If yours was set to manual seed entry and it didn't have a seed in it, it might that might have been why it crashed. Okay. Alright, let's close these. Oh, and you wanted damage settings. No, that's fine. You don't want damage settings? Why are my why is my volume so much quiet? Alright, we got it good. Uh hold on. 100% zero, zero, zero. I need to set my volume correctly. Okay. Uh, it would be cooperatively, I think. Uh, yes, it would be cooperatively. Basically, we'd be setting all the settings to the worst possible settings so that the idea is because we have many helpers, so the settings would be the most awful settings possible. Skulltala on, key sanity on, everything on. It's the worst possible settings, but we have many helpers. What the fuck? I'm not out of gin yet. Uh, hold on. Click. Make that go away. Make that go away. Ocarina. Randomizer. Wait, 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 wait. Go back, go back, go back. It's the same. It's the I same? checked. Okay. Because as near as I can tell, as long as you have the room name and the password, you can join in. It seems to be a server that's hosted elsewhere. It's not on our computer. Okay. Door entrance resume. Per see? Exactly. All right, shall we? Away. Let's do this. All right. Uh, uh controller? Ow! Controller? What's Where? going on? What, what's the problem? Uh, I think I'm having like dead zone issues. Um, play with it a bit. It should ease out. Weird. Uh, I can't lift shit. All right, so what's our plan? Uh, um, hold on. Let me turn off our microphone. Uh, I'm like having trouble hearing me. Well, you don't need to hear you. I do need to. You're pointless. I'm not pointless. Speak words. Words. <laughs> Speak more words? Words. There we go. Well, because I can't hear you either. That's a problem. Well, the, pro the problem is that you're a deaf human being. I, I am a deaf human being. Don't. Don't freaking like. I'll deaf shame disable you. Disable shame me. You're I the one you person all. who I'm allowed to do that on. <laughs> all right. Um. Okay, so what do we want to do? Where are we going? Do you are want you do, do you want to do stuff here or do you want to go do uh, Kokiri? I'll go do Kokiri. Why the fuck not? Five worthless dollars. Don't forget you can run faster by clicking the left stick. That is allowable. Why did you throw away the chicken? Because I had to get it over the fence. I can't climb the fence with chicken. Come here, chicken. I need you. You know what? This has been kind of fun. Just hanging out with people and chatting. That's been... That has been cool. I think... I think I understand now why just chatting 
is such a popular uh, category. It's just been cool to just sit here and run our mouth. Did that say five poco? I think it did, yeah. What's five poco? What's a poco? What game is that from, chat? Tell us. Uh, there's a gold skull toilet token. Cool. Oh, right. It's... Oh, no. I'm already not ready for this. <laughs> well, if you were ready for it, then it wouldn't be the thing that we're supposed to be doing right now. True. But, uh, if that's... If this is something that you would be interested in joining and playing, uh, let me know in the Discord. I will get you yeah, information that you need to get into the Ship of Harkinian Discord and get the get the download and everything for so that you can get all set up for. I got a heart piece. Well, that's interesting. No bots whatsoever. God damn it, Kaku. Until we started playing a game. Then suddenly... Immediate bans. Suddenly I like about, something that I like about uh, Ship of Harkinian is that it's got all the randomizer settings just built in. So you don't have to like go randomize it online or whatever. Some of the settings aren't, ooh, look at all these big items. Let's go. Ow. Ow. I got nut. All right, nut oh, and no. sword. Hold on, hold on. No, I'm over here now. It's hard to see. Oh no. No! Where do we start? No, Guess the we'll find in out. The mouse is in the way, hold on. Well, I'm here. Yes, I would like to save. Well, I'm here. Okay, good. Okay, that could have gone worse. Oh, my god every gold chest is a potential nightmare oh i got a tank shield nice uh 20 spiders is a gold skull toilet you have them use it to heal yourself idiot oh boy oh it's oh no it's shop sand that's fake right Yes. <laughs> I'm like, surely. Like, I was like, what? What Pegasus the Earth? hell is this? <laughs> no, Earth God's lyric. That's fake. Medallion Spirits. Water Temple Boschke. <laughs> oh, no. 30 Spiders of the Curse is Lens of Truth. <laughs> this is horrible. We're not going to be able to remember this. 50 is nothing. This is a nightmare. Okay, so uh, you know, we need at least 30 Skulltola tokens. Great. For a lens of truth. I, I don't like Shop Sanity because it's just, it's too easy. Because you can just go kill the Skull Kid and make money. Ow! My brains <laughs> and your brains as well. No, oh, here we go. Is it an item or is it just death? Yay! I got the Goran's ruby. What's in here? I Which way did I have to step? It was in here. Oh, no, it's not a soft lock. I have a shield. What? Which way do I have to step to set this up? Where are you? On top of the thing. Oh, you need to line up so that your left side is just a little is just lined up with the where, place where the boards cross, and then and then jump. God damn it! You're Wait. fine right there. Just go. We. There you go. Oh, sir. Gold skull to like two got. Sell shop sanity to me, Baldrick, because right now the way I see it is that it's easily sidestepped. Okay, fun fact: Did you guys in chat know that I didn't know that this chest was here for the last like 30 years? <laughs> it's about more items for place, more places for items to be. I got the Kokiri's emerald. 
Well, Hell that's yeah. two out of three jumps. Let's go. Woo. Brace. Oh, the adults want it. All right, we're on our way to buying that fucking $700 medallion. Wait, $700? Uh, there was something like that. What? Okay. <laughs> Wee. Shuff, 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 shuff. Also, Soren has been asking if she should play Ocarina of Time on stream. And unfortunately, that's not really possible for us at this time. But something else that I have told her is that if she's going to play Ocar Ocarina of Time, I think she should play the Ship of Harkinian Port. Because for me personally, I am not a fan... Oh, the giant swallow! Let's go! <laughs> I'm not a fan... Yo, get out of the way, chicken! ...of, uh... ...the 64 version of this game. At all. It has a huge number of issues... ...that... ...uh really impair my ability to enjoy the game in modern terms. As oh, no. Oh, here Three, we go. Three, two, on. one. Go on. <laughs> oh, you done blowed up. Okay, it didn't hurt you, I guess. For reasons. But the ship of Harkinian Port has addressed most of my issues with it. Like, I have found myself playing this port far more often. See, Cobalt says play the 3DS remaster, but I think this is better. With a good... With a good uh, texture pack. I think this is better. Um... And with the right combination of settings, I think this hits that point. I think this hits that good level of what the original designers intended. No, oh, damn it. What the original designers intended with like the modern accoutrements, like dual stick, like dual stick cameras. Etc. It's at that point where I'm like, the only reason you should play the N64 version is for historical curiosity. This is the, in my opinion, this is the definitive version to play. They have settings in it that make it so that it will play like the N64 version, like the the speed at which ow ah, fuck, are my damage settings the same as yours? Ours, I think it's still set to double damage. Let me let me make sure. Because I took two hearts from a bonk. <laughs> Much like you ow. took two hearts from a bonk. Let me let me make sure here. Or you could believe me. Well, I might be dumb. Yo, thanks for the subscription, Praxton. Pra Praxton? Conk. Um, all right, hold on. Enhancements. Nope, 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 nope. Get back out there. Gameplay. Difficulty options. I have my damage settings way the fuck up. These are not as high as your horse. I... Do we want them to be high? I, I, I'm telling you, you are wrong. Mine are just as high as yours. I bonked and took two hearts. You bonked I and took two hearts. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna check it. And if yours are not as low as mine, I'm gonna raise yours. Gameplay, difficulty options. Oh, yep. We're we're just for some reason at some point I set it to I hate everything mode. All right. So, uh, all of our damage is, uh, quadrupled, apparently. Hey, progressive scale. I'll take that. So, hey, Braxton, welcome. 
I honestly think the 3DS visuals are better. They they just they just are. I don't want a ballad of the wind fish. Fuck off. <laughs> oh no. But you know your miles may vary. You're allowed to you're allowed to like different visual styles. It's fine. Do 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 do. No. Do, do, do. Fuck me. Do do. Um, do, do, do. My flesh. <laughs> <laughs> but for a brand new player who has access to Ship of Harkinian, I really feel like Ship of Harkinian is the definitive port at this time. Why did I come all the way back up here? I am a moron. Get back down here, you piece of shit. Come on! You gotta oh, be close to him God. or else he won't do a, the thing. Whee! Why did I- Hey, bump oh, juice! I'm so stupid! Guys! Okay, chat. I want five dumbs. I am so unbelievably stupid right now. I completely forgot what I was doing and I died. I want five dumbs. Is bot not running? Is bot not running? He did bot should be running. He did dumb. Dumb. I think dumb has a cooldown timer though. No, it's not. No one's successfully done a dumb yet. Dumb's not working. Hold on. Bot not running. I'll fix. I'll fix the dumbs. Bot is running. See, here's bot. Disconnected due to unstable connection. Oh, we lost. It died oh, right, 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 when we right. disconnected. Let me let me connect. Here's where we would, could put all your dumbs, if we had any. All right, we should be connected. All should be well. Dumbs. Commence dumbs. I am I am admitting to five dumbs, because that was. I am very upset at myself with how dumb I was. No, oh, I hit the wrong fucking button. This is why I wanted five dumbs. Don't Did forget get to the, get that. We got the 500th dumb. I wish that I had taken the time to make a dumb hat. Like a physical dumb hat. Don't forget to get that Skulltola. Hey, I found the fourth medallion. I'm working on that Skulltola. I'm trying to do Panda Drop. Fuck. And I'm now I'm dead. <laughs> so uh, here's a question. What? Will this kill me? <laughs> Maybe. Please send me a cake. Do you know how much I would love a cake right now? No. Can I do this without death? Oh, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. <No> death. <laughs> I got it! Yeah. Panda drop successful. Oh. Some of you have my address. If you want to send me a dumb cake, I will be more than happy. I will, I will joyfully accept a dumb cake. Monster showed his junk, Link fainted. I got five boom dollars. Uh. I think I'm done in here. Oh, I got me a big chest. Prepare for pain. No, wait, I want this on. You remember how to set stuff to your D-pad, right? Oh, neighbor's love. Nice. Neat. Uh, I guess I'm done in here. Yeah, you can't really do much without the slingshot. Yeah. Did you get all the skull tools in there? Yep. All of them I can get to. All right. Did you... Up. Oh. I want both tool. vape and booze. Well, can you stop? Can you do that thing where you said you were going to go get my vape? Yes. But not before I find... There's my booze. Where's my vape? Oh, he's Why did a where's sec... My, where's my vape? I don't know. You put it somewhere. But I want it. Am I, like, sitting on it? Probably. But then it's gonna taste like farts. Oh, it was in my lap. 
Alright, I'll go get your vape. Hold on. Yay. Alright, uh, graveyard I want to check out for skull tolls. Oh, and I can do Dante too. Come here, asshole. A little more, idiot. Can you... Yes. Hey! Did Ark find two heart pieces while I wasn't looking? Uh, no, which... Oh, I hear you. Where are you? Oh, you're way up there. I can't get you. Ah, ghost. There we go. Wee. He doesn't give me anything, right? I have to play Sun's Song here. Where is the other hole? Here we go. Beep. Uh, forest temple small key. We need those. Maybe. I don't know. It's random. What do you want from me? I wonder how far away we can get from spelling kobold the way kobold is supposed to be spelled. <laughs> like, it's like, oh, Kobol, <laughs> Koblad, Kobo, Koob, Ko, K. Um, I guess we'll head over to Hyrule Market. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> Ko. <laughs> Blam, bubbly co. <laughs> I think there, if there's one thing that English is good at, it's being fucked up. Ow. Sacred forest meadows on the way to the hero, huh? Dude, when I walk in here and the room is dark, hey, and sacred this forest area temple is like lit up like this. There's this, like, blinding beam of light that emerges from this room. <laughs> mm, not much juice in here. Well, I got some juice right here. You can try it. Also, do not forget that you have bomb shoes. Right, bomb shoes. Which are in logic. Oh, so we're no. lucky we got those super early. Yeah. Oh, hold on, I fucked up the couch piece thing. I dropped my phone. Everything's horrible. Uh, so I got okay. the forest medallion. And that's about it as far as progress goes besides... Okay. This is great. Oh, whoops. I forgot about this. Okay, guys, I just want you to know, just for the sake of transparency, that I can do this. <laughs> we. <laughs> but I'm not going to. Ow, my shins. Uh, oh, there's a skull toilet in here, right? Where else could I? Do? What else could I do? Uh, forest meadows. Forest meadows. Have you gone in there yet? Oh, through uh, Lost Woods. No, I have not. All right. I'll oh God! In there. Oh, my back. What have you done? I bonked with two hearts <laughs> and died. <laughs> I want to love you, but you bonk yourself to death. <laughs> I just wanted the Skulltola. <laughs> A full heart! Yay! 
If only you'd gotten that 20 seconds ago. <laughs> I, I, but I couldn't get it 20 seconds ago because it was locked behind the death bonk. <laughs> Um, money. I have lots of money. I'll go check, uh, shop scrubs. I'm on my way to check shop shops. Uh, we I need think, those skull toilets. I think he's honest. Oh, It'll right, because 30 yeah. is, we need 30, right? What's 30? Yeah. One's the truth. Oh. <coughs> Technically, we don't, that's... This is what's so pissed about that, is that technically, we don't need the lens of truth for anything. We're just bad. <laughs> when he's a 10, but bonks himself and dies. I think Cobalt is having a very good time. Okay, um... How much is a purple rupee? 50. Ah, okay. Not 160. Well, of these shops, Mr. Big Man McGee, oh, wait, 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 wait. those explode when you. Yeah. You only need that for like to do that with holes in the ground. Right, 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 right. Uh, well, we got the shadow medallion. Yay! Hey, money. 200 gummy bears. Let's hey, go. Hey, full up, yo. Uh. Wait, are they Haribo sugar free? Oh no. I'm never going to stop shitting. Shit, shit, shitting. <laughs> Time to break my neck. <laughs> oh, can you go? Uh, can you go to the mask place and get the masks? Yeah, I think so. Cause I'm like right outside mask land. I forget. Does Impa get anything? Do we get anything from Zelda? Sure. Uh, uh no. Right now we do not get anything from Zelda. All right, you need the masks. If you get masks, we get all masks. Oh, so any mask. Hook shot, let's go. Hook shoot. <laughs> Great. Woo, wait, no, man. <laughs> uh, oh, there we go. I guess I'll go do the shooting gallery game. Yay! You get to do this for a change. I hate these so much. I got a gold skull Tula token. Skull. It's skull Tula, and if you think otherwise, you're a moron. I said it. I'm on the record. You're on the record of telling a lot of people that they're morons yep. when they're not morons. <laughs> and I got the sun song. And you're distracting me. <laughs> Sorry. Be better. Fuck off. No. Shit! You tried. I'll kill your whole family. You literal children can beat this game. Says the guy who does. Motherfucker! I hate you. Uh, sure. Thank you. Fuck sure, this. I'll take your token. 40 rupees. I, I hate this game. I, I hate this game. Dude, you miss dude, one? Dude, dude, dude. I missed two. Oh, fuck. Because I was too busy getting infuriated by your bullshit. <laughs> My bullshit? Your infinite bullshit. <laughs> I object. I object to your face. <laughs> oh, it was a skull toll token. Not a total waste. Yeah, I got a nut. I'm not doing bomb chew bowling. Fuck Ow! That. Oh, things will still kill you in there, by the way. Yeah, I know. I'm very weak and squishy. You know, literal children oh, could right. beat this, this game. the right way. Fuck off. <laughs> how did how did Markiplier put it? Eat my whole ass. <laughs> He put it in a lot of ways. <laughs> My favorite was just the high pitch. Fuck you! Yeah! <laughs> what was that? Pogo stuck? Oh, I got a water temple key. Great. Pogo stuck? That oh, was right, one of right. his rage compilations. 
He doesn't play rage games anymore, which, you know what? Power to him. <laughs> Power to his health. <laughs> Power to him for recognizing when something is good for content. Fuck off. What'd he say? 30 gold skull hollows reveals lens of truth. Ow. Okay, a ravaged village mourns the bomb mourns with a bomb bag. What does that mean? The fuck? Are they talking about is there something you can get in future That's in Twilight Princess. What are they talking about? Well, like Ravaged Village, right? Are they talking about like future Hyrule or are they talking about like Kakariko after Impa gets ragdolled around. Hey, Baldrick. Chica. What the hell does this mean? You know this game better than we do. What are you? Ooh, a heart. Be healed. Boy, you know people are desperate for controller tape content when fucking Baldrick shows up. Not because he, not because it's like, oh, fucking, he never shows up, but. Probably Kakariko. Like, that would be my guess, but, like, Kakariko doesn't seem to get very ruined at any point. Like, there's just that one part where it gets, um, burned a little bit, and then it's fine. It's, it's a, Baldrick's job kind of makes it very difficult for him to watch us. True. That, that's what I'm saying. Not that he's, like, some shitbag who does who never shows up for controller tape streams. It's Baldrick's issue is this Baldrick's issue with watching us is the same issue as Panda actually streaming. Oh right, I have to blow myself up. We because like we know we know Baldrick would show up here if he could. He, Baldrick loves us. We love Baldrick. Cobalt. We love you, Baldrick. Cobalt, same deal. Uh... Cobalt's like the fucking mascot of controller tape. Yeet. But, like, his job eats ass, so... Dude, I'll take a piece of heart for 10 rupees. Hell yeah, let's go. Uh, alright, I think I'm done here. Right now? So, where do I go now? I could um, adult it. You could adult it. Oh, wait. Oh, Gerudo I got the Bridges membership cards. We can go into the training ground. That's cool. That's not gonna be great for us because, uh, it's not key ring anymore. So, 90% of those... 99% of those keys are just out in Hyrule somewhere. <laughs> somewhere. Uh, you haven't done... Um... <sighs> Lana Ranch yet, have you? Yeah, I did. You did? I did it while I was waiting for night time. Um... Wait, do we have a scale yet? I guess oh, I'll we do. Go. Whatever this is, I can get it. I can't really Yay? see. It's a key. I'll go to... Adult Link now? You could go do uh, Gerudo Valley as Adult Link. Well, I guess. Oh, you're thinking like Chicken Drop. Yeah. Okay. Can you do that as an adult? <laughs> now, okay. Come on, that quote. Much too confident in his attractiveness. What game did that come from? Come on, that's not fair. <laughs> Every game. Fuck off. You know what? Lots of people want to screw me. You know what? Oh, wait. Everybody in chat who would like to fuck me, say so now. And... Cobalt Silence. in three, two, <laughs> one. <laughs> gotcha. Somehow that didn't make me take damage. Do, 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 do. <laughs> there he is! <laughs> That's. Uh, I don't have a anything white to song? Get. Can I get that? Like, I can kill it, but can I uh, get it? Shit. No. Well, at least I can. Alright, chicken, let's go! Chicken time. Chicken, chicken, chicken. Suddenly, I want KFC. I want Fuck chicken KFC. Yum. Look, listen. KFC's chicken is like whatever chicken but the gravy is god tier <laughs> i would go to kfc for just the gravy oh wait 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 this was a bad decision no chicken come back come back chicken no fuck uh i guess welcome to no wait what bonk into the wall until you die you're right <laughs> solutions <laughs> This doesn't help 
gonna I'm gonna wake up and be like, wow, Panda just convinced me to kill myself. <laughs> hey! Yay! <laughs> success. <laughs> Great success. I need to get this song. Do I need to be up higher on this rope? You know, Panda's right. The only person who even almost said that they want to fuck me is Cobalt. Nobody else wants to fuck me. I'm sad. Oh, wait. I need this chicken. <laughs> There's a quote for you. Nobody wants to fuck me. I'm sad. Wait, I need this chicken. <laughs> this chicken will solve this problem. Ow. Uh, I cannot get this goddamn... It is a very creepy white musical note. I have a feeling it'll kill me. Uh, Sheik wakes at a monument to time to teach a skull cult of the thing. <sighs> you know what will help my situation right now? More Ooh, liquor! Gin. <laughs> Why can't I not get this goddamn note? I have seen it done. Hey! Yo, up! Uh oh. Ow! My shield, no! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> I'm dead. Your shield is gone. How is your shield not gone? Because I just fucking died. My shield didn't have a chance to gone. <laughs> Wait. Well, uh, I thought maybe there'd be some sync up shenanigans. So what do we do now? <laughs> You're doing Hylia, I've done everything at Chicken Drop. I guess I'll go adult? I guess. I don't have- Can't really Hylian get into- shield. How many stores have we been into? Oh, go up Death Mountain. Have we not done any Death Mountain? No. There we go! Song of Storms! Wee! Yeah. Oh, I gotta do fishing. Ugh. Oh, there's the quote. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I was right. No one wants to fuck me. I'm sad now. Wait, hold on. I need to grab this chicken. <laughs> you know what? That's the perfect quote. Oh, Lake Hylia is on the way of the hero. Oh. I mean, there was a key. I here. think of all the quotes that I've ever said, I think that is the perfect quote. <laughs> Alright, <laughs> fuck off, Al. Any time! Yes. Thank you. <laughs> no, you know, just, just hang there for as long as you need. All right. Oh, fuck! I hit the button too soon. No, that's a bomb. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to nut. <laughs> no. Thanks. In the bedroom one day. No, that's a bomb! <laughs> I wanted to not. <laughs> Getting a lot of these forest temples while keys. <laughs> oh, you know what? Here you go. You can't get that. You have Fuck a shield. Off. <laughs> I'm trying to help. <laughs> what a dick. As far as he's concerned, in your world, I don't exist. You could get the Hylian shield. That's fake. Get the Hylian shield. Oh, Quake Medallion, get out of here. I can get ice arrows for 780. I didn't even see those. That My brain did not register right. them. Anyway, uh. Hylian shield. Oh, Hylian shield. Okay. And we get a discount. If I make this in, Tiger Woods is gonna. Dude, we haven't played PGA Tour we in a long time. We should do that sometime. Uh, I I'll grab this gold skull Tola token. That's a lot of money. Whew. Well, I think ten was a free token. Great. I think Let it's everything. Oh, I don't hey, want buddy. This. Do you understand? We. <laughs> uh, you got everything else in here, right? 
Did you do bomb chew bowling? No, because fuck bomb chew bowling with a 10 foot pike. <sighs> Here we go. Why will I never remember where the big fish is? I always Wait. have to ask. Baldrick, where's the big fish? <laughs> it's like right under the, um. Fuck. It's like right under the. Oh, come on! You don't need to do that for the first one. Fuck off. I do what I want. No, you harvested the child. <laughs> or was or is that No, you harvested the child. <laughs> you piece of shit chicken. There we go. Yeah. Dude, don't say that chicken. He came to you when you needed him the most. He was a fucker. Between two big logs, where the branch. Okay. So. Hey! Come on! That one exploded! You saw that right in the fucking middle. There it is. There. The first one exploded in the middle, and it didn't give me the prize. This game is rigged. You saw it. Post it on Twitter. Cancel Zelda. Whatever. Get me out of here. This one seems small. Yeah. I think Have I got you the done one. the nighttime city events? No. I forgot to do this. Okay. Because there's the shop, which is Shop Sanity. I'm poor. Story of my life. Ah, fuck. Ah. <laughs> Alright, this is the big one. Do you want to do, uh... Wait, where'd the money go? You got it already. Because I thought I went back in again. Uh, do you want to do the validation cast, or do you want me to do it? Uh, you do it, I guess. Uh, we've decided that much like Validation Chicken in uh, in uh, Link to the Past, uh, Validation Cast is now a thing where you have to catch the man's hat. And if you don't, it's an invalid run. I got the light arrows! Hot damn! Oh, Spirit Temple, Small Key. Can't do it until he's uh, until I'm an adult. Uh, there's a Deku shield for 450 rupees here. Uh, Bolero fire for 415 rupees. Ganon's castle, small key, 800 rupees. Okay. Gross motherfucker should wash his itchy pits. Yeah, he sits there and just. Scratch, scratch, scratch. I thought you were a furry. <laughs> Not everyone is into that. <laughs> Not according to the channels I'm in. <laughs> I guess I'll become adult now. What's in Zora? Ooh, what do I see here? Ganon's Castle boss key for 990 rupees. Jesus. Progressive Christ. bomb bag, give me that. 100 roops. Holy shit. Well, we got bombs now. That's good. What else do we got? Gold scope solo token. 780, 215. I'd rather have the Goron tunic. Like every other fucking picture, these furry perverts post in the Binghamton group is like, no, I hit the wrong thing. Haha. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Wait, I'm not ready to be an adult yet. Give me a moment. <laughs> Every post they post in the furry Binghamton porn group is, I hit the wrong thing. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Listen, you like the stuff no, you, you like. Them. It's fine. As long as you aren't, like, spreading disease. Have a good time. Uh, I guess we'll go do diving game.
Um, do we? Oh, we have the hook shot. Oh my god. Got the hook shot. Got bombs. Uh, I got light arrows. Whatever. I got nut. Okay. I'll go grab this Skulltola. No! Everything's Power going- Powerstone says he doesn't know if it's booze, but if it is, we need more booze before <laughs> streams. You know, we used to drink a lot during- before Dude, and or during streams. Alcohol and Doritos used to be our jam. Like, go back and watch the streams that I did with, uh, Zach. <laughs> Not streams, videos. Videos. We got fucking hammered. <laughs> The Robin Williams bit came from that yep, drunkenness. That was tequila and Dr. Brown celery soda, man. Oh, no, go the other way. Uh, okay, where do I want to go now? Uh, As adult Link. You have the hook shot, so you can get into Forest Temple. We do True. have a few keys for that. Don't have the bow yet. I just found the Forest Temple with Bosky. I guess I'll go to a Forest Temple. Start finding me more Forest Temple stuff. Bitch. <laughs> Shut your pie hole. <laughs> uh, did you... You got the drop. Oh, yeah, Cobalt Juice. When we did City Skylights with Cobalt Juice. Right. And that was, uh, Dick's, one, Dick's stream. One of the best streams of all time. That was that was the one where you were making very powerful uh <laughs> you're making very powerful road layouts. I was. That was also the stream where we discovered that you could just make uh shit. You can just fill your town with shit and they'll be okay with it. There's a They city would not be okay with now. it. There was just no consequences for yeah. your actions. They were like, this is very upsetting, but we don't care. Uh, City Skylines 2 is out, what? and I've been looking at it, and I can't tell what the difference is. Yeah, I'm like, why would you do, s if you're not Just doing, like, a DSA. Yeah. Like, if they're, if you're not making, like, massive graphical improvements to the engine, why wouldn't you just do more DLC? Uh, that looks like a real bow. That's something I noticed, was you grab the other bow, and it's like, wait, that looks so blue. <laughs> oh, death. Instant death. Uh, my bows always look blue. need to go down and get a chimkin. Get chimkin? Dude, now I want chicken. Maybe there's some leftover chicken in the fridge from that chicken dad made? I don't actually like curry. No, not curry. It was curry chicken, though. Was it? It yeah. didn't taste like curry chicken to me. Um, it just tasted like a grilled chicken with maybe a little herbal spices. I didn't yeah, taste like curry. I know given how voraciously I consume Japanese curry, it might seem like I like curry, but I actually don't. I don't like a lot of Indian food. Um, it's too savory for me. Japanese curry, they do some fucking magic with that shit. I, I will eat Japanese curry forever. Ooh, Gerardo Training's ground key. That's a start. All right. Uh, I got a... Oh, this is a 20 refined metal. I didn't think it was that. I thought it was this skull toilet. Man, if I had an ocarina right now. Creighton also wants chicken. Hey, everybody. Let's get some chicken together. Reset spawn in case I screw things Panda up. Panda and I will start up uh, Streamlabs on, on my phone, and we'll go get some chicken together. Where can we even get chicken at this time? Where's a 24-hour chicken spot? Surely you can get chicken 24 hours somewhere. Like, we could go get 24-hour sandwiches. For sure. Like, we could go to Palmer Pantry. Oh, yeah. Palmer Pantry, yeah. Yeah, we could get Subway sandwiches there. And I say Subway sandwiches because they're basically on yeah, par with Subway I mean, they're Subways. I mean, that's the definition of a Subway sandwich. Oh, you gotta do Have that you the done long way. Have you done... Fuck. I've not done anything in Goron. I'm so fucking stupid. Wait, why? Uh, let's see. Uh, Creighton says car stream again to get chicken. 
We did do that car stream, and that yep. was very fun. Very well. That's a. Oh god damn it! You goddamn chicken! You come back here right now! I still need you. Ow! Come back, chicken! No! Fuck! God damn it! I got no. a quiver upgrade. Hey, you! Hot kill damn. me! <laughs> no, come back! All right, Bo. All right, you have everything you need back as far as items. Yeah, I guess I could. Ow. In fact, just go Ow. to. I got Ow. a gold skull toller token. <laughs> Ow. You have one heart. I I know how many hearts I have. You don't need to tell me. Okay. I don't think there's anything. I could check the store. All right, store. Got to do store. And I can check Big Garon. Big boy. We don't have any heaving gloves, do we? No. I'm dead. Good fucking job. This is a good time for Jin. I feel like chat is being very rewarded right now. For... You guys who are in the Discord, because nobody else knew if this was happening except Discord. You guys, this is why you should be in the Discord. We listen, asshole. Get fucked. I can't believe it. <laughs> A heart! Yay! What do you have to say? I got the Spirit Temple boss key. Hell yeah. We're racking up keys. Hell yeah. Nothing's Ooh. gonna stop us now. Having such a good time. So fucking stupid is not a command, Braxton. Our constantly dying monsters is my turn with the HV. Wait, wait, wait. What, what did he say? Oh, a Sheikalitoscope. I'm sure that's a real thing. <laughs> what if those are real things and they're just code words? For uh, Shadow Temple has a Spirit Medallion. Don't we already have the Spirit Medallion? No. It, it was Quake we have Medallion. The, we have the Shadow Medallion. It said Quake Medallion right. in the... Right. Thingy. Oh, I'm gonna throw on my Goron tunic. So I can be an edgelord. Black as my soul. <laughs> Oh, let me go check down and check the store. Still no ocarina. Wow. Look at all this shit. We got gold skull dollars out for a thousand rupees. For 290 rupees, that's not bad. Heart container. 270 rupees. You need money. Go get me some money, please. Also, <laughs> the actual Megaton Hammer. Just out. Just, just 650 rupees. Let's go. It's a money hunt. Oh, and uh, this place has the... <coughs> this place has a Zora tunic. 300 rupees. <sighs> well, I have the Goron tunic. I guess I'll go... Oh, wait. I can't. I can't do that. Um, I could go up the long way, I guess. I have the hook shot. I have the hook shot. I can do the. Don't forget to get kill skull tolas. Right, 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 right. <sighs> Guys, listen. Don't listen to him. He's a fool. Just because we're more entertaining when we're drunk. Heart bees, let's go. Doesn't mean that you should tell us to get more drunk. That's not healthy. Please don't connect success and alcohol in our minds. All right, where is, oh, it's over here. It's here. Stop giving me dumbs, Power Stone. Ow, my heart. Go, go, go. 
You did dog, right? Dog? Yes. Okay. It's not worth it, Cobalt. Don't... You don't need to be drunk to be special, unless you're on Twitch. Uh, bigger on sword for 20? Yep. Take it. Thank you. I can't fucking see. I can't fucking see. I'll take that, 40. I guess I'll go into... <laughs> yeah, you best go home, you dick. You fucking cock. <laughs> These are the dumbs you asked to be given. Fuck you! That's what I gotta say for you. Hey, wait a minute. I, I gave you leeway for fifth uh, for I was about to say fifty dumbs. I didn't give you leeway for fifty dumbs. Go, no. my child. Yes. I know how to get through. Um. Cool. I got a nut. Nice. Um, a single nut. The spirit temple. There's, you know that, you know that room, where there's like, the. There's like the bridge on the other side and you have to like kill the thing. You have to kill like the spider or whatever on the other side and it will drop the bridge. Right. You can do that with a uh, bomb chew. You just have to time it right. But sounds really hard, except if you know that Deku nuts trigger bomb chews. So it's actually not that hard to get over there. Did you get the chest behind the wall up on Death Mountain? Yes. Okay. I'm literally on Death Mountain right now. Um, but I don't remember what... Oh, yeah, let me in there. I'll go do that. Oh, but you're the only one who can do... You're adult. Go do the Forest Temple. No, but I can't do Forest Temple. Yeah, you can. I can do Dodong, like, thoroughly. You can Because do... I'm adult. I can do it super fast. Why can't you... Where am I? Why oh. can't you do Forest? Um... You I have, lack things. You have the hookshot and the Please bow. Please let me do dodong. I know how to do dodong. Why don't you know how you do for a second? Because like I'm bad. <laughs> Why do you gotta make me do misery? Go do, um... Can't. That. Can't. You can do shadow. No. You can do spirit. No. You can do water. No. You can do... No. <laughs> Shit. Let's put, let's do Dodong together. That doesn't work. Yes, it does. Look, see, I'm doing it. Come in here. <laughs> Fuck. Come in here. <laughs> it's too late. It's not too late. <laughs> you have more bombs than I do. <laughs> we can do it together. Come on. You still have bomb shoes. Come on. <laughs> you do too. We can do Dodong together. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, Aaron? Yes. <laughs> I'm glad we're brothers, and you find it equally as weird if you'd be like, Come on, just give me a kiss. <laughs> Wait, progressive what? What were you giving me? Ocarina! Yeah, it was not a real ocarina! Where am I? <laughs> Yo, you're out there. Oh, did you get the item up there? No. <laughs> I am on fire. <laughs> I got a key. <laughs> that was a fake ocarina. <laughs> I ran out of composure. Eh. <laughs> Please put out the fire. <laughs> um, I guess I'll go do this shit. <laughs> no bottles yet. No, oh, I'm using all my bombs and I don't need to. I have bomb shoes. Fuck! I forgot what color things go to what thing. <laughs> I forgot things they thing to. <laughs> Come on, you gotta help me <laughs> with Dodon. No, you can do it Clearly all by I your... don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Thus it will be better. <laughs> Our fans are being treated to a rare delight tonight. Which is... Fuck. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo. Guess I'll go be an adult and. Oh, I got it. What is it? Skulltala? Hey. Hey. Nice. 
This is good. Hey. So the Skulltola chests have this Skulltola mark on them. Oh. That's nice. That's handy. <sighs> Time to be a big boy, I guess. Guys, I'm really trying to keep it together. <laughs> You're failing miserably. But you know what? Uh, tell us in the comments if you think this is hilarious. <laughs> the comments? You heard me. The comments. <laughs> uh, that's a fairy fountain. If you think this is Anyways. amazing, please let us know. Hit that, hit that like button. And that subscribe button if you would like to see us get drunk on stream more often. As I, as I, dead. As I said in my video, where I sadly lamented how we'll never be popular, we'll do anything for success. <laughs> where the hell am I? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> we <Whee>! roll. Ow! That did oh, so God! much damage. <laughs> It was like, why was it four hearts of damage? Wait, oh, you got the skull. All right, quadruple here. damage. No! <laughs> My heart. Let me get some hearts. Let me get some Hey, sauce. Hanyo, how you doing? Hello. <laughs> oh, I, no. you know what? I'm gonna grab some, I'm gonna grab some money. No, Carmance, that's what a Carmancer does. Right. Scree! I'm gonna grab some money. We don't have a bonus song, right? Nope, it doesn't even matter. We don't have an ocarina. I gotta be real careful, cause like, I'm a horny drunk. That's, that's uh -huh. dangerous. <laughs> like Skeeter, Skeeter is also a horny drunk. Bet you didn't know. <laughs> Check the wiki. <laughs> I want someone to edit the wiki now. <laughs> Skeeter got real drunk. Had his way with Doug. There was, that reminds me of the time I went. I was reading the Wikipedia article for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the cartoon. <laughs> like the 80s cartoon. And someone really had a fun time with it. Because, like, I'm reading it. And Sully starts talking about how they teamed up with fucking Yoshi. <laughs> And Captain Falcon. <laughs> <laughs> like, wait a minute. And I think it did, in fact, at some point mention Doug. <laughs> oh, you're in. You're in the fucking Lost Woods. Go kill the kid. You'll give. You'll fill out my wallet. Kill the child. <laughs> <laughs> I'm bad at that, though. You just poke him until he falls over. Like you do. Plus, you've got the sword of poking. Get him. Done. Done and done. Baldrick says the child's already dead, and he makes a good point. Oh, I went the wrong way. Alright, now I don't have to fucking deal with this cow anymore. That's not what Earthworm Jim was. Uh oh, <laughs> kill the child has been added to the quotes. <laughs> I'm not okay with the quotes that have been added tonight. Uh. I can all right. Over more I have story. this like permanent grin plastered to my face now, which is just that's a side effect of me drinking. If you ever drink with me for a while, you'll notice that I get to a point where a grin is just plastered across my face. I don't hit sad... There you go. Like, when I drink... You know this. I don't hit sad, morose maudlin. I just get really giddy until I pass out. <laughs> where I, like, realize, like, oh shit, I'm breaking people's glasses, and then I go to sleep. Um... Alright, where next? You are going to go to Dodong. Dodong. Right. Why did I leave Dodon? Because I died. I shouldn't go that way. That will lose me hearts, and then I will die faster. Gotta do this a slow fucking way. Do the dong. I try, but nobody ever shows up to my house. 
Maybe they're a little worried about the Baptists. Maybe they're a little worried about the dog. Maybe they're worried about me. I'm like, you should come over and do the dog. And they're like, yeah, but... <laughs> nice. What's in here? I'm gonna step right here. Hey, beans. Beans. Hey, buddy. I got that guy. Uh, shortcut time. Yep. Oh, we need... Uh, we need the Skotullas, though. When did you say I'm fisting chat? What <laughs> is that from? Like, some of these I know... I understand the context. I feel bad for these Dodongos. They sound sad when you kill them. I don't. They're like, Burr. they're all a plague. <laughs> Everything we kill, plague. Kill it more. <laughs> School tool. Right. 19 tokens. What do you got? Darunia's medallion! Of course we want that! I... Thanks. I look forward to having to do all this again. Winter is coming. Aye! And that didn't hurt me. <laughs> it's nice that it's random for both of us, so it's different for you than it is for me. I hit the wrong thing. Uh, Baldrick says they're just Lizarbs. Minding their own dang business until you invade their home and murder them. You know, fair. Uh, a single scrub in the crater sells an ice cra trap. Nice, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Firestone is about to actually shit himself. Baldrick, uh, no, no, no. Um, uh, Craden brings up that you once said everyone get anal vord for easy passage. Which one was that? Uh, that says Final Fantasy V. Oh, right, because you do did the thing where you go... Did we play Final Fantasy V? Yeah, played it all the way through. We did? We beat it with the cheese strat, where we, uh, got one person who maxed out on, uh, Ninja and Mystic Knight. The and, fuck? And they wielded, they did, um, they would use the, uh, stone the breaker blade on the boss which would instantly kill the middle part and then everyone else was just a max power red mage all right guys i want you to clip what just happened clip that expression on my face and the next time somebody says that like oh if you had eternal life you would go insane because you run out of shit to do send them that look on my face from not remembering anything that he just said at all and be like you just forget everything like it doesn't even take a couple years before you forget shit and you could just do the same shit over and over again and it would feel brand new oh that new. was a total waste that was two hundred dollars that i did not need to grab right now where am i i went through a door I'm not sure i wanted to do that but here i am now um all right i went in here i did the i did the dude Oh, I'm killing some lizards now. All right, ass bag. You're dead. Come on, ass bag. Lizards got nothing on me. I got a big sword. I got five feet of sword for two feet of kobold. Let's go. Those are big kobolds. But then again, we've also established that canonically, Link has always been incredibly like short. Like three feet tall. Nobody take five feet of sword for three feet of kobold out of context, please. You will anyway, but... See, kobold's already taken it out of context. <laughs> Wait, I hear a school tool. Where are you? A school tool? 
A squirrel turtle. All right, I'm going over here now. A squirrely turtle. I can't fucking see shit. It's so dark. <laughs> Guys, please. If any of you are just appeal. Let me get let me get real close. So it's you and me. Okay, hold on. I need my microphone <laughs> over here. Real Fuck close. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck! So it's you and me. If any of you have the money to buy us an OLED TV, mm. I have a wish list with an OLED TV on it. That would make now that we've added all this light to the environment, our TV is woefully underpowered. Not only would you be buying us an OLED TV, and Ow. this is not me being incredibly desperate, you would also be letting us donate this TV to my boys who live in their room without a TV of their own. What kind of life is it? What kind of man am I? <laughs> For children to grow up without their own TV. And before you say, what kind of fucking, like, privileged ass garbage is this where you're like, children should deserve their own television. Did you or did you not have your own TV at some point before you were 18? You did? Bullshit. Don't bullshit me. You did. So, if I did, you did. We were poor as shit. And I had my own TV. He didn't. Yeah, I did. Did you? Before you were 18? Yeah. I had one in my room. I watched MST3K while sitting on the bed drawing. There pictures. you go. I didn't, I don't even remember him having his own TV, but he did. You know what I didn't have? At any point, a good computer. That's true. Because they were always like, oh, we already got Rob the big fancy computer. We'll give him I've this. I've been doxxed. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you've said your name on screen. <laughs> um, they would be like. We already got hit. We are, bro, the bigger, the bigger, better computer. And that was a lot of money. So instead, we're going to get you this uh, Apple II. We bought you a Beyblade. Good enough. <laughs> and see, that shit makes me feel bad. Because, like, I had this Windows 3.1 computer that you never got your hands on. Even after it stopped being good. Yeah. Like that's that's why I had to constantly sneak into your room and like brute force your password yeah. <laughs> so I could play fucking Oblivion. <laughs> Squint. <laughs> but the point is, my boys don't even have a TV of their own. My son has an iMac, which is very nice, but it's old. It's like 2014 now. It's almost t 10 years old. That's getting on in years. So it still works. We could probably install Linux on it and keep it work working for another 10 years or so. But the point is... They would really... You had your own TV. Let them have their own TV. Buy us an OLED TV so that we can give this TV to them and my kids can have their own 49-inch TV. How good is that? Give that to my boys. <laughs> Donate that. Be a good person. You can do it. I believe in you. <laughs> I, I believe in you. Stop it. Get some help. <laughs> you know, Markiplier is over there on his streams. Being like, come on, guys, we can all donate to charity. I've already donated five hundred thousand dollars to this good hospital that is saving children's lives. Dude, do you know how much money we've given to Toys for Tots and Char and the the Charlie Brown Foundation and over the years? <laughs> Meanwhile, you're over here. Come on, get my kids a TV. Come on, <laughs> <laughs> with like the exact same voice that like a drug pusher. <laughs> It's like, do I look like the kind of guy that would do that to you? <laughs> you look like a snake! Come yes! on, come on. <laughs> children need good things. Give children good things. They need medicine and televisions. And my children don't have a television. Why is that so bad? Give them a TV. <laughs> and to do that, give us a TV first. We'll, we'll give our TV to kids. Because you give us a TV. Give us an OLED TV. It's less than a thousand dollars. It's triple it's trickle down TV nomics. Exactly. It's Reagan. Everybody <laughs> loves Reagan. Do the Reagan. Give us a TV. I saw a Fallout New Vegas video where they played the game as Ronald Reagan. 
And That's do you know why said. they did that? Because it's fucking hilarious. Because there's a specifically because there's a weapon in the game that lets you call down lasers from space when you're outside. <laughs> Oh no, I don't think I can go any further in this dungeon. <laughs> I wish I could play the game. Hold on, let me put Pepsi in me. That should help with the booze. Because I can't mix booze with anything here. The only thing I can mix Pepsi with is the rum that's in the other room that I didn't bring in here wisely. Hmm... Yeah, I don't think I could do anything this else in here. I need Ocarina. Of, I need the Ocarina and Song of Time or Boots or the power to call a Scarecrow. Who's Ave Lacone Panda? Oh, you're saying, what about the person who played through the Fallouts and Elder Scrolls as Ave Lacone? Same guy. Comma, Panda. He's asking you, Panda. <laughs> A blue cone. Uh, it was the same guy. Ah! <laughs> uh, hold on. I need to switch to. Um... And that was that was a fun series. Watching him play through Fallout Three, New Vegas, Fallout Four, and now the most recently he played through Skyrim as Abraham Lincoln. Have you guys seen the dude who who has done? Damageless runs of all of the Soulsborne series with a trumpet. He has a trumpet controller for video games, oh. and he's done damageless runs of every Soulsborne. You are not a success because you have not done a damageless run of, wow. s of Dark Souls 3 <laughs> Fuck with you, a Einstein. trumpet. You, you. <laughs> <laughs> you got all of that math right and changed the world as you know it, but you've never damaged those video games with a trumpet. Is it harder? Is is the is the theory of relativity harder than a damageless run of Dark Souls 3 with a trumpet though? I would say yes. War. Ow! Well, goodbye. Why? Me. What? 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 No, my what health. Me? You got traps. You got fucking ice traps. Oh, why though? For some reason, my headphones don't want to like. They keep like being like, wee. Widen them a bit. Like pull them out a bit so they're a little bit looser. They're all, they already feel kind of loose. Oh well, maybe tighten them up a bit. I tightened them up a bit and then became uncomfortable. <laughs> oh. I feel bad because like these these ear cups have been so good for me. And I think they feel good for you too, yeah? Yeah. Like they're comfy. But like Baldrick said that he was really struggling with them and I was like, oh no, did I recommend like I don't like I don't like making recommendations for people and then finding out that they didn't work for them because then I feel like an asshole because they spent their money on something, right? Like, and being poor, I know how much it hurts to spend $30 on something when you don't have $30 to spend a lot. <coughs> you have a hookshot. <laughs> Whatever. I got 30 Bitcoin. Ow. <laughs> Wow, he twisted you right the fuck up. He sure did. My asshole is a corkscrew now. Um. So oh, like, that's important. I hope that these I hope that these ears cups work out for him because I hate saying like, oh yeah, you should go do this thing because it's really worked for me, and then finding out that like they wasted their money. That sucks. I think I Braxton need... suggests that you change the shape of your head. I can't do that without severe brain damage. I would like to point out, like, I just lined up for that, and I was like, I'm gonna fuck the shit out of this up. <coughs> I even fucked up that phrase, but I managed to land this jump. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> My asshole is a corkscrew now, isn't now a quote. <laughs> nice. <laughs> 
play game do stupid. <laughs> that's you. <laughs> that's uh, that's the second controller tape <clears throat> mantra. Bodrick says the ear cups are working out okay now. I think I got used to the more restrictive feeling on my left ear. The feeling's kind of coming back now <laughs> that you made me think about it. Look, listen, just like, just squoosh them until, like, squoosh them up against <laughs> your head until I stop feeling bad. Squoosh that cat. Squoosh that cat. Exactly. <laughs> the snoot droops. <laughs> <laughs> it's a droop snoot. Uh, oh, I have to go this way because we need the... I'll just go inside this wall. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. Please remember that you have low health. Whatever. I got a bow. I don't know what to do with myself. God damn it. Stop making quotes tonight. <laughs> Ow. I only have one heart left. <laughs> don't get killed by the kobolds. kobolds that would can't be kill super me. embarrassing. There. See, he's going to run off like a bitch. Like all kobolds do. See, he's gonna dig in the ground, he's gonna be like, I found a sword! And I'm gonna be like, smash, done! Smash, yeah, you're kobold, gonna be kobold, like, kobold smash. done! <laughs> Dude, I smash every kobold that comes. <laughs> Alright, that one was on purpose. <laughs> no! <laughs> I just ran out of the ability to realize that the things that I was saying was not okay. <laughs> Would also like the question that like series of events in that scenario. <laughs> you said you smash every kobold that comes. Exactly. Which means I smash it comes. They're spent. No rest for them. <laughs> Why do kobolds need rest? I got nut. Let's go. I needed that. Time to get killed by Dante. Well, oh, here we go. You have one heart. What are you doing? The only thing I could think of to do. Uh, yeah, I'll take your stupid token. You Yo. got 24. Getting there. Uh, I'll take your small key. Sure. Great, thanks. Fucking god damn it. Hold on. Heart? Oh, get up there. I got yeah. an arrow. That's not a heart. That's what I said. Damp boy. I'm at this weird place where, like, I want to, like, pause and take, like, stock of myself. But I also know that if I pause and take t stock of myself, the stream will become less entertaining. Alright, what do we got? We got big chest. Could be death. And bomb juice. I'm gonna grab the big chest first. But the bomb juice could be actual bomb juice. We have actual bomb juice. Hey, it is fire. Nice. Now I'll grab the bomb juice, which are actual bomb juice. Hey, All right. let's go. Dompe didn't screw us for a change. Time to die. Okay, let me talk. <laughs> uh, all right, plant, give me a heart. That's a arrow. Fuck. That's kind of like a heart in that it kills you. If oh my god! Did I get through? Like, yay! I wasn't horribly maimed. I missed my jump! Time to get horribly maimed! What does Pepsi's logo look like right now? Uh, this is kind of a throwback style, so they're doing the throwback. Oh, where it's like the old stuff. Yeah. yeah it's kind of boring. Because this is like the natural sugar. They've kind of abandoned the really good label logo just the this this that I liked. Like, I really liked... They did this thing! A lot of people don't realize they did this concept with that design where it was like the sort of swooping bit where, where like the white line across the middle was thick on one end and thin on the other. And the idea was that for the diet, it would be thin across the whole way. And for regular, it would be thin and then thick towards the end, and then for Pepsi Max, it would be thickest at the end. Go around nice. bracelet. 
Maybe I can do the fuck. I think I can do the. I would love to do the fuck. For, I, I think I can do the forest temple now. And. I really like that. I thought that was such a clever idea. And they just didn't follow through with it at all. Ooh. All right. Got the two free skull toilet tokens from the skull house. We only need so many more. I need to stand outside until it gets dark. So we need what? Six more? Five more? Six more? Four more. Four more. Kick ass. And I hate it so much when I see these companies that have really good, really interesting, thoughtful graphic design ideas. And they don't follow through with it. And I'm 100% sure that it's because some executives decided that the American people aren't smart enough to understand this. It's like, fuck off. If stupid people don't get it, they don't deserve it. <laughs> Clip that. <laughs> I, I want it on the record. You heard me. I mean, that's been something I've been saying at work for a while, <laughs> which is we need to stop coddling the stupid people who apparently uh, stop going to school after kindergarten because they can't fucking read. Uh, one of my favorite examples was uh, the lady who came by was holding a package of country style pork, boneless country style pork ribs. The package said, Where the fuck did I go? On a big sticker on the left side, pork ribs. <laughs> and on the right side, where, where the actual tag is and the price, it said, boneless country style pork ribs. And she look, picks it up, looks at me and goes, are these the pork chops that are on Ow! She looked at me and said, are these the pork chops that are on sale? <laughs> I tried, guys. <laughs> no, you didn't. I sh I shout out, and then I hear like the chair coming up upstairs. I'm like, is Dad coming to yell at us? Cause I'm gonna be upset. The boys cannot hear me. Mom cannot hear me. The only person who can hear me is you. Go away. <clears throat> If mom could hear me, she will tell me tomorrow. She'll be like, shut the fuck up. And I'll be like, all right, I'm sorry, mom. I feel bad. I know how hard you work. I'm sorry. That owl was very much like- It was like very loud. I know. I no, understand. no, no. What Braxton was saying, that owl was very much like the kind of owl that your little sibling gives you when you like gently poke their shoulder. Oh, yeah, for sure. And Absolutely. they're like, ow! And you're like, <laughs> I'm sorry, are you a baby? Are you or are you purposely trying to get me in trouble? I'm purposely trying to like put on a show here. That's what's happening. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Ow. Because if I put on a show where I'm like Ow. That was very unpleasant. Ow, please don't do that anymore. People will be very much more upset by me going Ow in their ear than they would by me going like Ah I'm very upset with you right now. Exactly. Please stop. People I don't, don't think anyone that. was complaining. They were just saying, they were just saying, haha, that's funny to us. Exactly. But go on, keep explaining how that's, if it is important to the show that you do this thing. Ow, Jesus. What are you doing, Link? You stupid. Mm. Push. Uh, See, I've never had, I've never been a little sibling. I've heard a lot of people say that being a little sibling sucks. Is that true? It only sucks if... I think it only really sucks if you have someone who's either much older than you, like one older sibling that's much older than you, or if you have a lot of older siblings. Because then you're the punching bag. Ye Where's my vape? It's in your butt. It's a butt vape. It's a pocket vape. Sweet Lou. I've always been. I am the actual. I'm actually the oldest of a generation. I'm the firstborn son of 
any of my generation. So I've never been younger than anybody. So like, whenever people talk about being like the younger anything, that's not me. So I, that's not an experience that I have in any context whatsoever. Yeah, middle sibling sounds like it'd be the worst because if you are the eldest sibling and you're not a huge fucking failure and disappointment, then, you know, you're looked on as the model that all the other children will be judged against. And if you're the littlest sibling, you're given a little leeway, right? And you're taken extra care of. If you're the middle sibling, no one cares about you. I've realized that we haven't had any game music this entire time. That's why I've been trying to fill the gap. No, come back! You stupid lizard. No! That's the wrong button! No, that's the wrong thing to do! I'll just go over here. Stop failing. I can't, I'm the oldest sibling. I expect this to be our most popular uh, VOD of all time. Just on the merit of everybody in chat is gonna watch this like seven times. Uh, Bloodspot would like to uh, give us the reminder that your local blam blam on is not a Tatango and should not be force fed blam! <laughs> <laughs> That's don't... when the Count grabs you by the mouth just like Blaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
Where do we go now? Ow, ow! <laughs> I bonked my head and then got clawed in the spine. <laughs> Um, listen, just for the record, it's not something I'm torn up, torn up about now. You don't have to be like, oh, pa oh, 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 Panda, I'm so sorry about how Ark feels. <laughs> yeah, no, because how you feel naturally. <laughs> They're just miserable that I'm <laughs> having to listen to you. Uh, where should I go? Um. What do I have? I Jesus guess Christ, what can we do? Um. Can't do Jabu, we don't have a bottle. Can't really do anything in Fire Temple either. We haven't even found any keys for Fire Temple, I don't think. I mean, I can do. Can you get? I can no, open we, the front door of Fire Temple. We can't. That's do, really it. We can't do Gerudo. Wait, we have a flute, don't we? No. Yes, we do. I picked one. Oh no, that was a trick. Yeah, we were like, yeah, and then it froze Fuck. over. Listen, Cairo. That's how I feel, and it's bullshit. Like, legitimately, like, that's how I feel. I feel like the only women who've ever been with me have been with me out of pity. And it's bullshit. Like... It just is. It's really, it, like, it's, it's... I can't... I can't reach through to the lizard brain, you know? Because the lizard brain's fucking stupid, but... It is bullshit. Um, I know that. What is it? No, no stop! I'm dying. Help! <laughs> like, it's it's not true. It's not easy to hook up, and it's even harder to have like relationships. But. Uh, I need to go up the mountain. It's... It's not your fault. That's... That's something that gets... That gets really miscommunicated. I think. Just, like... Reach out to people, you know? Like, I got on Bark. B-R... B-A-R-U-K. Let me spell it right so you go to the right place. I got on Bark. B-A-R-Q. Which is this, like... Furry focus. Ah, ow! Was just this furry focus, like social networking kind of. I guess dating. It's not really focused on dating, but a lot of people use it for dating. But I got on this website because my friend Jay was like, "You should get on this website and try. You should get on this like service and try it." I was like, "You know what? Fine. Fuck it. Why not?" Worst that can happen is I is that is that I waste the 15 minutes it takes to put together a profile, right? I met a bunch of people locally. A bunch of people. Panda has now met them as well. Panda, are you glad that I got on Bark? They were cool people. Yeah. Like, it felt pointless while I was signing up. It felt like, oh, I was just absolutely wasting my time. But it turned out to be a worthwhile endeavor. So, like, try that. Get on Bark. B-A-R-Q. See who's on there. If they're near you, like them, send them a message. Right? You know, worst case scenario, you meet nobody. Best case scenario, you meet a couple people. You find a local group. That's what happened to me. I found a local group. Dude, our town has, what, 800 people in it? And there's, like, three lo- Three- Three- as you can see on this hand that I'm holding up, three local furries. I was like, really? And in the Binghamton group, there's like a hundred plus. I'm like, are you fucking serious? And I've met a bunch of them. And I've been, ah! <laughs> Good job. I've been really happy that I've met these people. And I would have thought that there was Nobody. That would have been my first thought. If anybody had asked, I would have thought that there was nobody. Maybe like one or two, but I'm gonna, not going to meet them on Bark. 
But no, there's a whole crowd. So like, get on, reach out, you know, connect with people. Maybe you'll meet somebody who's really special. Wish. Are you fucking kidding me? What did I hit? The I just floor. ate shit and died. Uh, you hit the floor. Yes. Reach out and touch faith. Do 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 do. Listen. I don't care who you are. Rob, uh, not uh, uh, Marilyn Manson's version of that song is the tits. I list. I first heard that song at 150 miles an hour in a van on the way <laughs> to the recruitment office. <laughs> Like two sergeants in the front seat, tearing past cars, numing in and out of traffic at like 150 miles an hour. Reach out and touch grass. <laughs> and uh, when we got there and we parked, we parked in a handicapped parking spot, right? And we got out and I was like, this is a handicapped parking spot. And they were like, what are they gonna do? Ticket us? We're the government. And we went <laughs> inside. I was like, okay, welcome to the army, I guess. Uh, all right, what am I doing? Oh, all right, I'm going to go in and... Um, wait, can I do this? I don't think I can reach there. How did I get down there in the first place? Where did I die? Here. Here? I died here and it spawned me down there? It's spawning me here. How did I get in here in such a way that I respawn down there? What did I Ow. do? <laughs> I need to find out how I got down there. Because that's how I'm going to get into the fort, the fire temple. Because I can't get down there otherwise. I don't have an inn. Right? You go through Darun. I can't go through Darun. Oh wait, yes I can. Guys! Please leave me alone. No. No. Don't hurt me. <laughs> oh wait. Ow. Why are you so invincible? Ow. Uh, Baldrick says I was warped by the fake arena. Arena? Ocarina. Can I please start this room? Well... I will say this about the military. The army was simultaneously the best and the worst experience that I've ever had. I would not give up what I went through in the army for anything. It taught me so much about who I am but at the same time god it was awful you didn't reach out and touch enough faith I guess not like one of the things that the army taught me is that you are capable of so much more than you think you are And it taught me that in a very simple method. Sometime what I want you to do is I want you, this is me talking to you, the audience, the viewing audience, I want you to go do push-ups. I want you to do as many push-ups as you possibly can until you get to a point where your arm, if you can't do regular push-ups, do the kind where you're on your knees instead of on your toes, but just do push-ups until you get to a point where you literally cannot push yourself up anymore, be honest with yourself, where you're you hit muscle failure and you're just like ah, and you cannot go up anymore right and you think you're done give yourself five minutes and you can do at least one more give yourself five minutes of rest and you can do one more push-up you can do so much more than you think you can if you just are willing to push yourself that was something that I learned from the army from being in a position where I didn't think that I could do any less 
than everything that was asked of me. Where I didn't think I had the choice. I learned that I could go so much farther than I think I can. And nothing else has taught me that. Um... All right. Um. Okay, I need to go back to back down to Darumia. And ow, four hearts. God damn. Like, you can do so much more than you think you can. I pro ow, I promise you. Whoa. some heals have a good sleep cobalt I hope that you have a good morning leave All us right. on we'll lull you to sleep lullaby and good night I am driving panda crazy here's me inside his brain and you won't fucking shut up <laughs> You guys don't understand. When I do that, he hears me, like, literally inside of his ear. <laughs> do you actually have any oxygen left in your lungs? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? From being alive? No. I'm dead now. Would you hold still, you motherfucking piece of shit? <laughs> God. Sleep well, Cobalt. Sleep well. Eh. Suck shit, Rock. S suck shit, Rock. Ow! Hey, I got a Fire Temple small key for you. Right, I forgot about the whole, like, um, hearts thing. I can't go in that room because I don't have a hammer. I can go in here. Clink. Do we even know what we're doing? Nope. We're just sort of dicking around until our stream time runs out. Alright, I got a key in here. What is this key to? This is a Gerudo Training Ground small key. That's a good one. It is a good one. Don't bonk. Okay. We don't have the key for this room, right? Do we? Uh, I don't recall. It's been a blur of what the we've boss been, keys have been. We've just been kind of talking about Yay. bullshit for like hours. Or... Talking about like both really funny shit and really uncomfortable shit and kind of blending them together. We're a Louis C.K. bit is what's happening. I don't want this. We're, <laughs> we're retooling everything. <laughs> then we get absorbed into this block. <laughs> Hmm. Um, let's see. Where would we see what keys we have? Is there any, like, interface that says that anywhere? Uh, you have two keys right now. Oh, I guess that would show it. It wouldn't, would it show if I had the boss key, though? I mean, you could try walking up and going through the door. Power stones be duping. The audience is be duping. The boredom is collapsing in on itself. <laughs> All right, what do we got in here? I got a key. I can get through here. Did you try going through the boss door? Uh, no. I can't reach the boss door. Yes, I can. Fuck. How do I get back there? Oh, I just go this way. Sometimes I'm smart, chat. <laughs> it's Badoop. It's not deboop. We don't want you to unboop. Never unboop. Dude, praise roof cat. It's been so long, but you know what? You know what the power of truth is? Is that it's always true. Praise, praise roof cat. But don't praise roof cat. Don't. <laughs> No, Roof Cat doesn't like Wait, that. how do I how do I line this up? I forget. Um like that. Perfect. Uh I don't have the key. Okay. Tick, 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 tick. 
Dude, how much do you want there to be a night in the woods to? I don't necessarily want a night in the woods too, but I wouldn't want. Oh. No. Oh. <laughs> well, so much for finishing this. I would dungeon. love to see more game in that universe. Yeah. Maybe not the same characters, but like. But what makes? <laughs> Oof. That was on purpose. What I'm curious about is how much of that was. How much of that world and story was created by the dude who has kind of been publicly disgraced now? Who is also dead, I think? Well, that's dark. I'm a bit sick of dark. Ow! Why did I explode? Haha! <laughs> 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 Not this time, idiot. We. Um. Like how much of that? How much of that was like? How much of Night in the Woods was his brainchild? I guess. No, you piece of shit. Ah. Okay. Like, are we likely ever to get a Night in the Woods two or? Oh Jesus Christ! That, what is happening? That, that hit me so hard. I haven't been hit by a bat that hard since Coda told me not. anyway. <laughs> yeah, but it, we'll just let that float around in uh, question space. Coda's gonna be like, you piece of shit. <laughs> you sold me out. Hmm. Um... Listen, we've whacked Codas around enough on this channel. Everybody knows that. Let me up. I move. I jump. We're I professional grab. Coda whackers here. <laughs> we are professional. Preventional? We are preventional Coda whackers. You're drunk. <laughs> You're drunk. Let's just be honest about it. Uh, listen. You weigh a whole nother one of me. It is. Way easier for me to get drunk, to girt drunk, than mer. <laughs> this is like when oh, her mom has a I little wine key. and dad does not let her live down any of the time she misspeaks. Yep. Except in your case, you deserve it. <laughs> no, hit the right button, you piece of dump. Yay, heart! No, give me the heart! Oh, I know how I can help you. Oof. Listen, here's the thing about Coda. At some point, I realized, I was like, I found out that Coda had gone on a trip to Japan. Neat. And I was like, so many questions. Oh, I'm out of keys. So many questions flooded into my mind, right? <laughs> What does Koda do for a living that he can just go to Japan? Does he have contacts in Japan? It, does he have family in Japan? It, does does he have a job that like has stuff to do in Japan? Is he Japanese? And I slowly realized as these things hit me that I don't I know less about Koda than I thought I did. <laughs> Wasn't there a skull toilet here as an adult that you can only get with a hoot shoot? Uh, there's something there you can only get with a boomerang. But I don't know if it's there as an adult. Because I think we're at the point where the most important thing is just... I've gone as deep into fire as I can. I thought that was a skull toilet. It is a texture. <laughs> um. So now I'm not sure. We might be on a skull toilet hunt. We need one token to get that lens. But again, the lens isn't required. It's just we need it because we're bad. But, like, what do you need the lens for? Shadow Temple and, well, and we don't have access to either of those yet. Lens or not. Um, 
Watch our VOD! Watch our VOD! No one even knows, like, why this is happening or what that song is. Or why we're repeating it. Uh, Creighton points out chest game. That's fair. I would like to buy some financial services. I would like to buy some finances. I would like to buy a vowel. <laughs> and that vowel is eh. <laughs> eh. Eh. Um. Fuck, what have we done and not done? We haven't done Jabu. We need a bottle. Like, what temples? We haven't done Shadow. We need Lens. We haven't done Water. We need Boots. And Long Shot. We haven't done Spirit. We need... Lens. Or... Are we really on just Skulltala Hunt now? I mean, it's the largest item spot lo pool in this Fuck. game. Why did we do this? Let's get drunk and do Skulltala Hunt. Wait, do we... It was going fine at first, but you just kept drinking more and more gin. Oh, right. This is my fault. I agree. Listen, gin is tasty and get fucked. I'm not saying it's not tasty. I'm just saying... <laughs> You know, there's a point at which you could have said, you know, I should take it easy on this. Dude, I want a new iPhone. We've got iPhone 8s, and they're okay. Like, they're they're still functional. But they're at a point now where I'm starting to feel their age. Like, and I don't even want a brand new state-of-the-art phone. I was looking at iPhone 12s. They'd be fine. I'd be happy with an iPhone 12. iPhone 12 mini? Perfect. Mwah, gimme. Um, but the eights are starting to show their age. Boo. Uh, hey, Skulltola token. Wait. Have we done Zora? We've gone through Zora's domain. Have you gone up Zora River? Yeah. Okay. What do we have? Ow. Uh, well, you died and I'm in the temple of time. Cool. Time to walk all the way back, pay another 10 rupees. <laughs> um, have we done any of Gerudo training ground? Hey, Buttspot did grab the alert. Nice. Geared towards unlocking a game more. Blaze, cried to get him. Blaze, or your eternal blood and blaze. Blaze, so Ark, turn the heater off. Blaze. I want one, one time I wanted to take someone's <laughs> like message. All right, and you're doing Gerudo Temple, yeah? Yeah. Have we done fishing game as adult? No. We don't have flute. I can't get up there. We ha no. There is one thing we do have. Beans. Beans. None of, oh, I guess I'll go be a kid and start planting beans. You sure will. Fuck. Bean bitch. <laughs> You're call me a bean bitch. <laughs> There's only one person that gets to call me a bean bitch. You know who you are. Goku. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Oh, here we go. Brace. <laughs> she had a hard time with that one. ARC? <laughs> what you just arc? heard was the sound of someone being legitimately heartbroken. ARC is a real word, though. Why didn't she say ARC? She said turn the heater off when it was all caps. Why not ARC? Maybe because ARC is also an actual, like, maybe? Maybe it's like a company. All right, away I go. All right, where are beans? Where can I plant beans? Um. 
I'm just gonna do I'm just gonna do the rounds. Beans get planted everywhere. Let's go. Ow. Ah, I get fucked. How are we going to buy shit that costs more than 500 rupees? With the Tycoon's wallet. Is that a real thing? We said it to be. Did we? Yes. Are we sure? Mm -hmm. That's not in the original game. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Kill me. <laughs> the worst of things. Uh, time to walk all the way across Hyrule again. And spend I'm ten more plant dollars. Some beans. I got. Be I can plant beans here. Have you stopped in this store to see what uh, is in here? Uh, ha, 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 ha. Boy, Ganon sure sounds derpy in yeah, this did... one. All right, I can I can buy some stuff here, maybe. Spirit Temple. I'll take that. Uh, I don't have 715 rupees. Spirit this is a medallion is of spirit. That's just a medallion, as far as I can tell. I eat shit, game. That said, that the medallion is spirit. That was bullshit. Oh, because it'd be called the Spirit Medallion. <laughs> that one was sneaky. That's for you, game. Right here. That's you. That's you. That fingernail? That's all you, baby. You're a fingernail. Yep. Don't know what that means. Nope, not a clue. But you're but it's you. My body is now at a point where it's like you either need to keep drinking or I hate you. Um, I'm gonna go this way. Why? So I can plant bean here. It's useless. Maybe there's a moose in their backyard. You never know. M moose probably smell bad. Could be moose. Like, you ever, have you ever snorted a, no a moose? Have you ever snorted a noose? Don't snort you nooses. Ever, you ever tied one up and just been like, hold on, before I die? <laughs> oh, yeah, wow. That's a, that's a rich, earthy smell. Ugh. <laughs> dum -de -dum -de -dum -dum. <laughs> this is so much bullshit. Dum -de -dum -de -dum -dum. Why did you dum -de -dum -de -dum choose these settings? Someone. You said it, it would be funny. It's just sad. It was funny. Have we checked these grottos out here in the wilderness? Yeah, I checked them. Okay. Uh, the water temple medallion is in the one where you need the gold scale or the iron boots. Okay. I'm just gonna go plant more beans. Plant bean. Vanilla extract and moose. <laughs> Vanilla moose. I've never had a vanilla moose. Is it good? I don't know. Do you like moose tracks? I have an open mind. I'm willing to believe that sucking a moose off is... <laughs> moose. Moose, baby. <laughs> vanilla moose. Mm. Taste. What about cinnamon moose? I don't know the song for that. If I know anything about... Because uh, you have, like, Graham moose. You have, like, Teddy moose. And then you have like cinnamon mousse and chocolate mousse. Don't get kidnapped by the mousse. <laughs> Clearly, you don't know everything that you do and don't have in Washington. That's true. Moose are very prevalent in Washington. They more as they well are uh, murder bears. No, oh, you fucking idiot. You're two inches away from the hole. Which smell an awful lot like moose, now that I think about it. I've never smelled a moose. But I'll bet it smells amazing. School tool. Give me that. I found a long shot! Woo! Oh, hell yeah? I'm almost sad at this point, every time we find a major upgrade, because I'm like, oh... Now we have to do shit. <laughs> Did you open this grotto here? Ah! 
Why don't you blow yourself up and find out? Yeah, but you could just tell me. Or I could try to create a funny scenario. Or I could just put a bomb down. How is this funny? I'm just gonna live here now. Have a good night, Cray. Good night, Cray. Or good day. Good day. Good day, mate. Good eye, mate. Good eye, mime. <laughs> good eye, mime. Mime? That's how you say mom. That's how you say mother. In Australia, as you say, man. Oh, All right, mine. time to try this again. Oh, are you doing this bullshit? Well, that's five dollars, so I don't need that. Can't really go all the way over there. I'm hungry. There's pizza in the car. I forgot to bring it in. Oh, fuck. It's in a box. It's fine. You're gonna get out there and there's 700 badgers. <laughs> I hate it when I leave food out and badgers show up. <laughs> it's the worst. Why am I here? Why did I come? I know why I came here. Charge! Chicken! Ow! You don't need to know Power Stone. Arg! <laughs> Oof. They sure do a lot of damage. But you know what I wish I had right now? And I'm really pissed at Panda about? Is that right now, I wish I had a little bit pumpkin cheesecake. <laughs> Ow, my flesh, stop it. Stop! <laughs> Where else can I pl plant beans? Um, I, there's a bean I can plant in the fire in the, in the volcano. But I don't have the song to get there. Um, where else could I be? Jesus Christ, eight hearts? They didn't do that much damage the first time. Christ on a stick. Um, where else could I do heart? Or what else could I do bean? Why am I... Oh, I could do it at, um... Base Zora. Ow. Well done. <laughs> if you go outside and see 700 badgers make peace with your god. I feel like you could say that with almost every animal. That's true. I walked out of my house and I saw 700... Poodles. Poodles. Something's wrong. <laughs> Something has gone awry. I don't know why I'm from Virginia, but here I am, surrounded by poodles. And not in possession of something. That wasn't a joke about Virginians being filthy. That was just me being amused by the way Virginians say subtle. We got a Skulltola. We've got 31. We could go collect that uh, lens at some point. Did we get all the items on the way up Zor's Fountain or Zor's River? Yep. Okay.
Oof. Brax says, on a stick is generally where you see Christ. Yes. Big oof. All right, where else can I be? Did you get Death Mountain Crater? I can't do Death Mountain Crater. I don't have any way to get down to the... Sure you do. No, I don't. I sure don't. We don't have a song. Just jump really hard. Um... Where? There's one other one where it's like actually useful. Oh, it's a spirit temple. Where are you? You're in the spirit temple. How did you get there? I'm not in the spirit temple. Where are you? I'm in Gerudo Training Ground. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. Because I'm still doing this horse shit. Look, it's close to the spirit temple, okay? It's got all the same stuff. If I could get to the spirit temple. Have either of us seen where you end up if you die as adult Link? What's the respawn point for adult Link? I don't know. I'm not sure I know the respawn point for kid Link, actually. Here, take me to the respawn point. Skelman. Big! Help. That was glitchy. Help. Help! 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 What's going on? What's happened? No! Why are you controlling me? I'm not controlling you! What am I- what's happening? Yes you are! You just pressed R, we both shielded. The horror. Why? You're not connected anymore. What the fuck? Can you move now? It glows. And then it stops glowing. It's like it's... Now I'm controlling you. No, that's wrong. What the fuck? What the fuck? What is happening? Ah, why? 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 Ah, <laughs> Stop! Well, Why the chest? Thank you guys so much for joining <laughs> us today. The game is broken. I'm I have not enough I have not not enough wherewithal in me to fix this problem. <laughs> and on that bombshell. <laughs> so uh we'll just uh <laughs> That that was too much. I don't know what's happening, and I don't have enough oomph in me to uh, sit here and try to fix the problem. Uh, the game has decided that both controllers are all controllers, and all controllers are no controllers. <laughs> I don't know. That was... It was like it was reading all of my inputs. It was a message from God. It's so like it was reading all of my inputs at <laughs> once. He's <laughs> plugged in. Oh, wait, oh, we gotta do all these things. <laughs> bomb sword, bomb sword, turn around, turn around. Z, 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 bomb sword. Catch up, he did so many things. That was weird, sorry. Sorry about that. You're gonna, you're wanna, you're wanna gonna bonk a honga. I'll remember that one. Dude, I I love it when there's some 
some big bonkahongas. Some real big garble of gongolos. Look, I'm gonna be honest, it's been quite a while since I've seen a good pair of bonka honka longos. <laughs> like, you can see them online, but there's nothing quite like seeing them in person. Or like, giving them a, giving them a squeeze. <laughs> Of course, everyone knows what you're saying is bullshit. <laughs> Absolutely. But you know what? Even gay people know. They're like, resting your head, a nice pillowy pair of bahonkalonk gongolos. No, those don't have to be what you think they are. Exactly. They could I be could anything. be talking about, I could be talking about turbochargers. <laughs> you could be talking about... Go, go to sleep on an engine component. You could be talking about big old fat plushies. Exactly. <laughs> I've I've slept on a plushie or two. I've slept with a plushie or two. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> You're saying words. <laughs> End the word emergence. <laughs> you wanna play on a Blanca honk alone. <laughs> well done, bot spot. Add more blay. the fuck what a weird way to end the stream seriously game's just, just like i don't want to play anymore and leaves <laughs> <laughs> but i mean we could sit here for the next half hour trying to fix a technical issue when i'm already like <sighs> yay hawks you what a good stream this was it was fun, it was drunk, and it's just starting to get irpy. <laughs> Perfect time to say thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with us. Um, Come hang out with us again sometime. Yeah, Monday, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Cleo's returning to the channel with her first of what we hope will be many streams. We are playing the Twisted Tales of Spike McFang. It's a Super Nintendo action RPG. Got a bit of, you know, it's about a vampire. Spooky vibe. Sure. Why not? Um, and I need to, need to double check with Soren, but I believe we'll be back Wednesday as well with uh, more streaming fun. I believe we're playing Zombies Ate My Neighbors on Wednesday. Do you know they made a Zombies Ain't My Neighbor's Doom conversion? No, I did not. I heard that there was a sequel that was planned that never got off the ground. I think it's one of those games that underwent, like, transmutation. Probably. When, like, plants fell through. Sort of like how, uh... The third game in the Zool series that was supposed to happen became Ninja Bread Man yeah. and Trixie in Toyland and all those other games that are exactly the same <laughs> as Ninja Bread Man where they just were just like you know what put some more graphics on it put some different graphics call it a new game sell it capitalism Ghoul Patrol why does that sound familiar because you've probably seen it somewhere probably it's cropped up in magazines so, yeah, a woo. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with us for a drunk stream. Um, nothing has been said tonight that is problematic or in any way that should have been put into the quotes pool. But you bastards did it. You did it, you <laughs> motherfuckers. I want to try to move away from using, like, fuck. As, like, saying, like, what a fucker or you motherfucker. Cause I feel like that's not an effective insult, at least coming in the next like 10, 20 years or so. Like shit sucker, I feel is a little better. Like you piece of donkey ass, that's a little better. But like, what's wrong with a fucker? Yeah, what's like, wrong with a cocksucker? Nothing. I'll tell you why. Cause there's this distinct difference between a fucker and someone who fucks. Maybe. Like what is a fucker? Like, is it really so wrong to fuck your mom? 
Like is and it? we're going to call it for the night. <laughs> Let's just end it there. Before any more quotes can be added, Let's just can proceed with our own evenings. Listen, assholes. If you add that to quotes, I'm going to be upset. Uh, um, anyway, so, yeah, thanks. Thanks for hanging out with us. It is... As usual, the part of the stream where I say thank you guys so much for hanging out with us 12 or 13 times. Because we still haven't worked out a new, uh, like, uh, an outro. <laughs> so. Bye. <laughs> but. Oh, I don't have. The, hold on. Fucking goddamn it. Have things and react to me properly. Listen. Bye. Grow up. Bye. This is who Bye. we are now.